Waku 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 waku. Hi gang! Hello, hello! Hello, hello! Oh, choosing white text was a bad idea. I am wearing a white shirt. Do you want me to just move it over to me? <laughs> yeah, we can do that. I stole it. You stole the zero Gundams that I we have I stole packed. it. Oopsie, oopsie, oopsie. Hi everybody! Happy Sunday. It's very early today. Um, I missed your stream! We're back! We're back! Well, do you know... We were what getting, do we know? Okay, well... <laughs> We were getting ready, and I look at it, I'm looking at it, and I'm like, how does it feel for you, a beautiful woman, to build with your younger brother? <laughs> how does it feel to share a hobby with your younger brother, your 13-year-old brother? <laughs> Pina put this hat on. So this is the new Huff Gundam collab. She's still got the tag on it because she's a cool guy. So that's what the kids do. So she walks into the room in the new Huff hat, and she's like, tell me I look like a 14-year-old boy. And I was like, you know what? You look exactly like our dad when he was younger. I look like our dad. His dad has this sweep hairstyle with the short curl the, at the back. The luscious This is locks. our this is our father right this here. This is hey, call me daddy. <laughs> yeah, he has the he had like the the short and long, but not a mullet. It was tasteful for the time, and so I'm rocking it. Yeah, thank what you for noticing. What does the hat say? It's the year 0079 of the Universal Century, and then it's got the Huff logo and the Gundam logo. It's green on the inside, and I'm, I'm not- I'm a hat gal, but a bucket hat gal. But because we got this, I thought I would wear it. Yeah. Plus we need to take pictures of it after. We're gonna so. go do a little photos in the hat and of the necklace. Isn't it pretty? Can you guys see the necklace? It's like it's our cool. X head. Isn't that cool? I think it's pretty neat. The chain is longer than this. Peanut helped me, um... Oh, I'm gonna drive myself. She tied it so. a little bit here for me, so it was a little bit shorter and kinda... Cause otherwise it's... She gone. going down. You can't see her, she gone. Lost. Yeah. Yeah, the show lost about this necklace. <laughs> it's actually about us. 100 episodes or so. Kinda crazy. Necklace gone. Thank you, Onimaru. Thank you for that waku waku. Waku waku! Thank waku, you very waku. much. Thank you. How is everyone doing? It is a beautiful, clear, uh, sunny sky out. I'm trying um, to get this to reconnect. It has been so gray oh, and oh. shitty. Don't mind me, I'm just trying to figure this out. But it's good now. It's all good. It just says connecting, hello, but it doesn't want to connect. Hello, Gundam Deck. Hello. Yeah. The YouTubes and the Twitch. How's everybody doing? Um, we've kind of been sporadic with our streams we've we each have things going on mostly this one yeah you guys um, know we've been we've been through the ringer yes I'm trying to get the yes. twitch chat to reconnect on my phone it just says connecting and it is teaching me about banks it's a lot to learn this that is a lot to learn um yeah so thanks for being patient guys we do really appreciate it everyone has been very cool um cool. and understanding and thoughtful um, while we, we work through this. Oh, I think it connected. I got the redeem. The redeem came through. Okay, we so got it's working. First pack. Yes. I, I still, it won't let me do anything while I watch ads, but. You guys are going to help us pack you, Gundams. Yes. So for those of you who are unaware and have just accepted that we've been missing for three weeks, I think this marks the third week that I have received my notice that I have to vacate my rental unit. Yeah. So I have to be out of here in May. So we're going to start packing things up, getting her schmoovin'. So we were like, you know what? It would be kind of fun if we had chat pack the Gundams for us. Mm -hmm. So since I'll be building today, Peanut's going to be the one packing. She's got a bunch of different size boxes. She's going to... What's the process? We'll show them the process. Okay. So you've got, you've got a bunch of different size boxes here. I might put them. That over you're here. gonna kind of pack things into. Yeah. And then I have a bunch of sandwich baggies because whenever kits have extra parts, I keep all of the extra stuff in case we want to do any kit bash, in case we want to change out their weapons. Yeah. So she'll have to find the corresponding baggie that the the kit goes with. 
And then put the kit in the baggie and into the box. And into the box. So Packing you're, them away. You're gonna have to like surf through a bunch of sh stuff yep. to find what you're looking for. Yeah. But it'll be fine. You can put this uh, on that black. Yeah. This yeah. little stool. I got the hyucks already and we just got here. Hyuckin? So you already have your first redeem from Onimoto. So, I'm gonna go pick one. Do it. Um, she she did have something special to tell you guys too about this packing endeavor. Yes. Um, as the incentive, because there are sixty five to get through. Sixty five. Some we're counting as multiple. Some are singles. The very last one will be the very special one, and I'm not gonna say what it is. But y'all will get to see it. But you will finally be able to see it. If we get there. If we get there. If we get 665 there. 665 to go. Yeah. Okay. I guess we'll start. And then while you do that, am I okay to flip a Reno to, to this cam? Yes. Ooh, I gotta stretch. Yeet. Okay, cool. I know this one is near the top, so I think I'll do this one. Should I do them as a pair or just single? Single. Because I counted them as a single. Oh, did you? Yeah. Okay, there might be more than 65 Gundams. Oh no, I counted them, like, not as a pair. Oh, as a... Yeah. Individual. But I think their pieces are together. In the same bag. Yeah. How do I... What are you looking for? Oh. These. Here we go. Hi, hi, Hick! I got the Hyuckies. I got the Hyuckies. I gotta figure out what page I left off on. Okay. This is the one of the Acer Bs. Acer B A or B. I do not remember. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Focus. Ba -ba -ba. Focus. This is Smiley as That's me. a 30 minute mission. She was super cute. These builds were so fun. I really enjoyed these actually. They oh! I really enjoyed these builds. One of my most recent faves. I like her little pose we have her in. Cute cutie pie. She is a cutie pie. I love the eyes, the alien eyes. <laughs> They're cute. They do look kind of alien-y, huh? Thank you, Onimuru, for helping us pack that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A-N-E. I'll need a sandwich baggie for uh for this guy, too. Where are the kitties? There should be extra pieces. They're around. There's also the one. third kitty. Third kitty is there present is a third and accounted kitty. for. She is under the bed. <laughs> Where she is likes my to guess. Be. Is my guess. The others, um, I don't know. They're Hanging out downstairs, maybe. Probably where all the excitement is until they realize that we're streaming, and that means they usually get snacks. They've um, built themselves a fortress out of all the cardboard boxes that I've been using for packing. <laughs> I would do the same. <laughs> Which is kind of funny. I would do that too. They have been a big fan. I'm making her compact. Oh, <laughs> popped her head off. Too compact. What the? What the? I'm flattening her hair, and now she looks like a model. Okay, I'm <laughs> playing around does. too much. I'm having too much fun. No fun. Here we go. Pack her away. And then you gotta change the. I already on it. You already did the one. Dunzo. Damn. Got one packed. One packed. We're out on of, our way. Out of sixty-five. <laughs> Yeah, we have a lot. I, I kind of thought we'd have more than 65. Is that... I mean, there's a couple in the closet. Is that ambitious of me? That to... I did not count. Oh, you didn't... There's only... There's the Strike, the Calibron, and the Shorzet in the closet. Okay. So there's three built Gundams in the closet. Mm. The Calibron, because I didn't have any space to put it. Yeah. The Schwarzet because it's gonna be the competition piece, and the Strike because it's so big. Because it's huge. It was gonna go in the second display case that is still in a box because we got the display case, and then later that week we got the eviction notice. So I was like, what? Unlucky. I was super unlucky. Truly unlucky. So unlucky. It is what it is. But that's okay. okay. To... Ooh, what if I can do a live translate with my phone Ooh. on Google? Ah, I dropped a piece. Because I cannot. Oh no. What are you looking for? A what yellow color? piece. Yellow. Lello? Yeah. I don't see a Lello <laughs> piece. Is it under the chair, under the table? It I, it I definitely hit carpet. Oh, there, there. Do you uh, see it all the way? Reach. Yeah. Here you go. Thank you. 
That went uh, not where I expected. A25. Oh, freebies. live translating. <laughs> Hello, hi, it's nice to meet you. I can't do it, so I just watch videos. Sorry. That's okay. That's okay. Hello. G Art Studio, it's very good to see you. That's a okay. I um I don't really build either. <laughs> I I'm not a big building fan. So that's a okay. No problem. And the video with D-Art is up now on their channel for anyone who wanted to go and watch. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, we did a little interview with G-Art. It's it good to see fun. you again. It was very fun. It was fun. I cut this piece out preemptively, but I saw the V-Fin and I got excited. So oh. I, I yoinked it early. I see. Yeah, no kitties. No kitty visits today. No, not yet. Have you bought the Cosmos LED for this kit? No, no, I have not. Not yet. We haven't experimented with LED kits yet, so I feel like the way that we typically operate, whenever there is something we haven't tried before, we procrastinate doing it because we haven't done it before, so we're like, mm, should we try it? And then we just keep putting it off and doing what we do. Yeah. Not that we're disinterested, but we always assume things are way harder. Yes. Things that can seem intimidating. We've never done it before. Um, so it's hard when we have other things that we also need to get to, to kind of jump into it. Oh, and set aside the extra time to learn. Mm -hmm. It's tough. Maybe someday we'll set aside, because there's the, there's an LED thing you can get for the MG gun tank. I think it came with at least one little light for the gun tank, didn't it? Yeah, but we don't have batteries. A little headlamp for it. Um, so maybe something. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. No mercy, Mike. Thank you. Hi. Thank you. Thank you for Hello. the follow. Oh, I didn't hear oh, the oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah. I didn't either. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Can you scroll up on the audio bar so next time it happens I can see what it does? Yes. Because I want to I wanna make sure that moves. Oh, actually. Did you guys try building a bootleg? Oh. Oh no, that's Wait, the wrong. Sorry, I'm messing around with settings. All good. That's not what I want either. Hmm. Okay. Remains a mystery. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi, hi Hello. Mike. Yeah, I was hoping I could mess with the settings. Just try where building a bootleg kit. How was the experience? We have not yet. We haven't yet. Not yet. Um. I know that there are some kits that... I feel like they're harder to come across in Canada. Here, yeah, they're hard to find. But there's certain kits that only exist as those, right? As bootlegs. There's ones that don't have official releases, so you kind of yeah. have to go the bootleg route. Yeah. Yeah, and I know there's one... I don't remember the name, but you want it. Stargazer. The Stargazer, that's right. Stunning. Hey, Smiley and Peanut, how are you two feeling? I cried twice yesterday. <laughs> Happy? No! Oh. No! One was right after I got off the phone with the realtor, because mm -hmm. I was trying to... I thought the property that we were offering money on was... I could get less than what the realtor was pushing me for. And it felt like he was just disregarding anything I had to oh. say. And I don't know if it's because... I'm a woman, You're I don't know if it's because I'm young and he's not taking me seriously. I don't know if he just wants me to buy a goddamn house and leave him alone. Mm -hmm. So I felt just so shitty after that phone call. Yeah. And then shortly after, while I was already emotionally in shambles, dad gives me a call. Oh, yeah. And dad wants an update on everything. He has very strong opinions because he's very protective of us. Yes. Um, he was very vocal on his opinions on the realtor and told me what he would have done in that situation. And I'm like, of course. Dad, it's you're coming my gone. dad. I'm not going to do the way yes. that you would handle this. Yes. That's a lot. And then we, we part ways. I talk to the realtor again. I come back and I think, I think he calls me back again Aww. later. 
And then he's like, you put too much money into this oh. offer, you shouldn't have done this, you shouldn't- And I was like, this yeah. is the most important purchase of my life, and I feel like I'm just disappointing my father. Fuck. So I cried again. Oh. I was a wreck yesterday. Buying a house team truly is an emotional roller coaster. Like, it's- it's super fun, and then it's super shitty. And, and then super not. And, like, that can all happen in one day. <laughs> and it did. <laughs> and, and it did! Goes to show, it did. And it did. Yeah. Oh my Soink. goodness. Hey bird soup. Oh gosh. So that's my update on how house hunting is going. <laughs> Yay! It's so fun! <sighs> it's gonna be worth it, gang. It's gonna be great. At some point, it's gonna be great. At some point. Hey, we're gonna... At some point, we're gonna get Up there. and up. So in the meantime, we're packing some Gundams. <laughs> yes. Let's go back. Remember he works for you. Yes. That's what dad said too. Dad was like, I would've fired this guy and got anyone. I, I would have like, said, well, mister, you're being real stinky right now. And I can tell in a conversation when like, I know I'm not getting through and I've just had it. I go very quiet. Oh, I'm the same. Because I'm like, I'm it doesn't same. matter what I say because nothing is making any difference. If so I go very yeah, quiet and if, I just concede the conversation. Yeah. If you're not actually going to listen to what I say, then, then I'm why not going to bother, bother speaking. Why bother talk? Yeah. Yeah, I'm the same way. I think I heard the alert. I'm glad you guys are hearing the alerts, but- Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I did oh, yeah, not oh, hear yeah. it. No, oh, I didn't yeah, hear oh, that oh, one yeah. either. That's why oh, I was yeah, like, yeah. thank you, Flow Dog, actually, did, for helping did the bar us move? test that. Oh no, I, I, I don't, don't think, think the I bar saw. moved. What is going on with our alerts? The bar is not even moving. It's not even trying to make a sound. Wait, but they're no, hearing why? it, so it's doing something. Yes. Flow dog team. Did you Thank hear you that? Thank you so much for the follow. Thank you. Did you hear that? Did anyone hear that? What did we break? <laughs> Hello, ladies. How are you doing today? Bird soup. It's a lot. <laughs> <laughs> We're. I'm doing good today. Bird soup. Today is a new day. Yep. I am so tired. Do you know what? That's so relatable. I. Okay. We're doing good. 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 Busy. Tired. But good. Mhm. Mm oh. Yeah, and then we gotta go out into the cold and take some photos after stream today. Bird Soup did not hear it either. Okay. Dang it! So, we will figure that out. Oh no. My English nickname, Ranji Dadpla. Oh, cute. That is cute. Yeah, our audio settings, I don't know what I did. It was kind of around the time that I did the whole- I heard like, it? Office okay. reset. Flow Dog heard it. See, Matic heard it. So they, some are hearing it. So it, it just doesn't like us then. Most of the things don't. Yeah, we break stream consistently, gang. Yeah. It's usually the same things. Mm. Sometimes it's spicy and something new breaks. Yeah. Yeah, I got my house back in 2001 and I'm glad I don't have to deal with uh, today's house market. Oh, it's so yeah. yikers. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, Dad, I love and appreciate you. You probably bought your house for three hundred thousand dollars. You probably bought your house for a couple of pennies in pocket lint that you had, maybe a couple buttons. So I don't want to hear it. And when people are like, "You would," prices you would are the same as they were back it. then. And I'm like, I'm gonna cry. Yeah. I don't ask for a lot. Just a roof over my head. Yep. Have, and not a crime riddled neighborhood. Do you have software you use for audio uh, routing? I thought I uninstalled it. If I minimize all of these, this one. Because there was a recommendation before to look into. I wonder if you're doing this. If I turn this off, are we suddenly speaking louder than we were speaking a second ago? I think we are. Hmm, okay, so microphone. I, ah, mm. I did something to the microphone. Oh yeah, we, act, we I are. I don't know if that's gonna fix. Let us know if we're being a little too loud because I see it going up here sometimes. I think normally we want the audio to be in the yellow area. Okay, good, 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 good. This is audio one-on-one -on -one with Peanut and Smiley. <laughs> Well, where we learn how to do audio for a stream, and you guys are actually the professors. Audio for dummies. Audio for dummies. You're looking nice today, Smiley. Thank you, thank you. Peanut encouraged me to wear this shirt that I've never worn before in my life, but has existed in my closet for probably about six months now. Yes. 
This is the new Huff necklace that I was very excited to wear. And then this scrunchie was from Peanut. Look at how big it is. It's large. Can they see it? I can't. Well, yes, I'm, yes, like, they can see it. My head is, oh, even I can see it if I go like, look how yes. big that is. It's big. Dude, I have a kitten on my head. Oh. I got a, I got Peanut says I'm giving cheerleader and she's a I'm 13 year old giving boy. father. <laughs> yes, I'm giving 13, 14, 14 year old boy. Audio 101, don't let the line turn red. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're not in the red. Onimoto Pack of Gundam Gumpla. You get to pick another one. Thank you. You've done that twice now. Thank you, Onimoto. Yeah, 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 yeah. But if the sisters really want to buy bootleg Gundam or through Pretty Kit, try. Daban 8820 Snow White Custom Wing Gundam. Snow White Custom, that sounds pretty. 8827, my bad. What am I doing with this piece? Good to know. Maybe if I held it the way that it's telling me to hold it, that would be a good idea. It's adorable. Yes, it is. She is so adorable. Like this. Okay, I will but pack then... one. I'll pick the other Acer B so then I can put this bag away. That goes on first, this goes on. Under? Nani. My girl. Under. I don't think this wants to do what I want this to Can do. Can I leave this door open? Yes. Is it going this way? And this <laughs> is the Acer B peanut. This is the one that I built. Let me flatten her out and show you here. Beep. She's super cute. Again, I love these builds. So good. Good luck, girls. I am jealous. Gundam Ariel is on my list to buy. It's a very nice, very, very nice quality kit. The quality and Please. the way that it looks very much reminds me of the Tamashi Nations figures, if you've ever seen those before. That's how it feels to me, because last year I worked at a Tamashi Nations booth, so I was picking up and moving a lot of these figures, and that's like the quality that I get from this. You're gonna see if they both fit in the same bag. Cause that's where their spare parts are, they're together. Make sure her arm doesn't break in transport if she's uh, sticking out like that. Get in there. Get in there. Oh, they're snuggling. Oh, isn't that so cute? They're cuddling. Sisters. 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 BNF. Oh. Oh. She's dropping runners. So we're two, we're two out of 65. Two out of 65, gang. Boink. Wow. Look at that number climb. <laughs> <laughs> We're doing our best. You know what? It, little bits at a time. Yeah. Little bits. Little bits. Oh my god. I used to know someone that would say that to me anytime I said little bit. Mm -hmm. And it turned out I said little bit a lot. Oh. And I didn't realize how much I said little bit until they would be like, little bits. And it drove me... Nuts. <laughs> ninja Gundam. Hi, Ninja. Hello. What's going on, Ninja? How are you doing? F. I got up this morning, um, kept hitting snooze on my alarm. Oh, is it one of these ones? Finally <gasps> got up. It is one of these ones. Got ready, laid on the couch, snuggled Mia, and then Ooh. I felt really bad because I had to get up and make her not so snuggly. But she gets eye goobies mm -hmm. and like little... She has, like, constant dry eye. So you know how little white dogs get that brown goopy staining? Yeah. She gets that. Uh -huh. But she's a cat. She's little my, Mia. She's my little Mia, babe. Um, so I, like, I pick her eye goobies, and she gets, like, little boogers. And so I clean her face up, and she's so good about it, because I'm sure it feels better once it's done. And she can breathe properly. So I snuggled her, cleaned her up a bit skedaddled came over here and brought you food yeah it was good doing fine playing gta 5 when does 6 come out this year next year i think typically gta games i think release in like the springtime i think they're typically may release well it's springtime now oh yeah oh yeah i have oh, it yeah, oh, yeah, oh, in yeah. my brain that it's synonymous with like my birthday oh BBA yeah oh yeah time. I didn't oh, hear it, but the alert box moved. Ah, oh, so Should why can we see it, but why can't we hear it? Should I move it up higher? No. Because moving I it up. Crank it. Hi, Linux. Hello. Linux. I don't Hello. think we Happy crank Sunday. It. I think cranking it might burst crank everybody's that soldier ears. Boy? 
had to think for no, a second. No, I mean you. You know. I recently watched a video, probably because of Token. Okay. Because Token's always telling me that I dance like a white girl, and I miss me Token. being me, I was like, I'll show you dancing like a white girl. So I looked up a Soldier Boy video. <laughs> I okay. We have to go out into the garage like we used to, and I'll film you doing the Soldier Boy dance. Nice. The full thing. The full Soldier Boy. Is that Dispay Nippers? The ones that I have, these ones are Nine Steps Industries. These ones are God Hands. They look very similar. When was the last time you cranked that soldier boy? Like the full thing? Probably when I was like 10 and you were 12 or 13. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Foot yeah. job! What a great name. I definitely cranked it this year, but not the full Soldier Boy. Yes. The full... I can do like the 20 second cranked at. Yeah. Uh, and that is my pride and joy. <laughs> but you did at one point know the full thing and you would teach it to me and the kids in on the street. I, uh, cause I'm a cool guy. Cause you, she's there a There was cool also guy. one point where I did the Soldier Boy dance in front of my entire high school gymnasium for the talent show. That With, you didn't want to go to. Oh. As a uh, student council. As a that I didn't want to go to. I don't think you went. I would have been in grade 12. I was on the student council. I was the minister of finance. I would have been there because it's a school thing. I asked you about it and you said you didn't remember or you weren't there or something. Maybe oh, you were just definitely... being a student area younger sister and you were like, no. no, I didn't see my big sister cranked dead on the stage in front of all these people. <laughs> <laughs> That's embarrassing. <laughs> That's so embarrassing, actually. No, I was definitely there. I remember because I remember the, the dance to the the in sync or like Backstreet Boys, the bye 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 yeah. bye. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Do you do you guys want to see? I do have a picture of what I wore that day. Being a cool guy. Being a cool guy on the student town, student council <laughs> on the student council. Buenos dias. What's going on? Play mo shred. Those razor files have come in clutch. I like them a lot. They're so good. I, I I don't even know how to use this social media platform anymore. I'm like, how do I get to my photos in this? I feel like a gr I'm a grandmother. How do I know my what is your favorite in the uh what is your favorite? Which for Mercury? Um What is my favorite gun number? What is my favorite mm, character? I think Robot. I still don't know how to go to my Robot photos. Oh I like the um the Delanza or the Darabaldi. Darabaldi. I like any of those are the ones that you like. I like any of those guys. The the chunkier kits. But you like the the Schwarzette. <laughs> this was yes, my get up for this. I remember. This there you student. are, right in the middle. That's me. Yep. I remember all of those Guys, people, tell me of. that I'm super cool uh, for being on the student council and then cranking that soldier boy. I'm wearing moccasins like a fucking loser. Oh, look at you. Good times. Good times. I hated that high school stuff. I didn't mind it, but I never participated. Because I'm not much for participation or teamwork. Early stream today. Yeah. Yeah earlier today uh, now fortnite dances have taken over that's true Lex. <laughs> that's true um what is my favorite gun from which from right here i thought it was the at the start of the show it was the elfrith because i really liked the way it looked as the show went on um middle of the show probably a pale technology suit I hydrate like pale yes The end of the show. Oh, look at all the sugar at the bottom that I didn't stir. I'm missing my sugar rush. And my straw is now like how could you do this? Water and can't stir anything because it's that is peak. My straw is dead, so I can't stir all the sugar on the bottom of the cup. You're getting it. Um, there you go. My favorite by the end of the show was the Shorzette. I fell in love with the look of the Shorzette. I thought it looked absolutely amazing. I thought I was cucked a little bit, that it wasn't like as important of a suit as I thought it was going to be. And that's all I'm going to say without spoiling anything. But I looked at that suit and I was like, you're a fucking badass suit. Yeah. And then it was like subpar. Yeah. And I was sad. <laughs> Yikes. 
Thank you for the hydrate. Thank you. It was supposed to be next year, but it might have gone, got delayed. The razor, the what? Oh. Razor nippers? I get. Or the display? F3. The shiny. F3. Housing issue get resolved? Question mark? No. no. <laughs> but things are moving. Things are moving. Paper straws are a terrible invention. They're not the most epic. I heard that they're finally going to get rid of them. If they had just, like... Thought it through a little bit? I don't know. Thought of a different option? I don't know. Uh, no, still packing, still preparing for move date. Yes. Um... I think because I've been in the housing market for a couple of weeks now, I have a very good understanding of the houses that I want, how much they go for. So now I'm able to up. like offer around the price that people are expecting for their homes. Because when I first started, I was naive and I was offering what people were listing the houses for or slightly above. And they were like, Fucking jokes on you, kid. I want 150000 over asking. Jokes on you, kid. So I got played a little bit my first couple weeks of house hunting. But we're getting there. Yeah, our, our Lazaro has a pack up. Did you find the bag for her? No, it's for, I haven't looked yet. You gotta scope I through all of the... This is Bianca? Uh, gun girl Bianca? Commander... By, who is it? I think that one's Bianca because mine's Daisy. Yours is Daisy. Commander Bianca, Gun Girl, Lady. Gun Girl Lady. Gun Girl Lady. Because I, unless that's the wrong way, because I always say the Gun Girl and the Lady in different. Yeah, it's in the, in the wrong order. It's a different variation. Who knows? Yeah. Um, these were really fun. <gasps> we got a kitty. Oh my boy. Hi, little man. Good time. Cat treat. Hi, little sweetie. Cat treat. Waka 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 so, waka. I'll have to see if I can find big. At man. some point, I'm gonna have to change that to Cat Treat Three. Thrice. Token! Token! Oh my god, hi. Token, we were talking about you earlier. We were, actually. Did, I said I missed you. Were your ears burning? Is it your ears burn when someone talks about you? Mm -hmm. Or do you sneeze when someone talks about you? Mm -hmm. I feel like my anime gives me different answers. Aw, oh, the little man. <laughs> the little man, hi. Hey, look at him. Do you have, um, do you have cat treats in this room, sir? Little man? I don't know if he's got cat treats in here. I'm gonna have to check to see if he's look got- Look at that face. See if he's got little snackies. Look at that face, eh? That's Token, the face thank of you a, so much! Welcome back! Boy. Yeah, we'll have to get you Ugh. a little snack on mister. It's weird how stuff is going that way. Around here stuff is going for below asking. There was only one house that I saw that went below asking. I went to go look at a house that had oh, the washer yeah, in the yeah. dark. Like, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, in oh, yeah. the living room. Like, not- not in an enclosed mint. It was just like in the open. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Thank you oh, for yeah, the follow. Yeah, yeah. That's, That's a cute, a cute cat. cat. That's a cute boy. Let me get him snackies. This is a cute man. His name is Loki. Show off the cat. Show off the cat. He is the youngest boy. He's like two years old now. Um, the oldest is getting up to three. And then little Why lady is like nine years old. Do I not have treat season here? Uh, I wonder if I packed them, packed them away. Let me grab more. You were talking about how it was uh, my birthday this Friday. This upcoming Friday? The 29th. That is exciting. Good boy. Can't wait for the packing stream. Oh god. We're kind of packing things up. We have... I have to update the number. But we have a redeem that you can help us pack. Let's see if I can summon Big Man. Oh, I did! I did! Nice. Lucky, lucky. Oh. She found Big Boy. Oh. Thank you for that follow, Mecha Girl. Mecha Girl of the Day? Good name. Oh, Mecha Girl of the Day! I follow that Twitter! Oh, 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 <laughs> oh. oh my god, oh my god. Look! The Big Man! Now, keys. You both get your kitty treats. Whoa, Good whoa, boys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is this from Yellow Whale? Yes, it is. Thanks, Good Yellow. Man. Oh my god. Manners. Hello, just looking, just joining the stream Good for man. the first time. Going to start up the RG00 Razor. 
Trans Am Clear? No, that's pretty cool. I like some of the clear kits. They're really neat. Here you go, boys. Go to your box. Go to your box. Ooh, Good watch the nibs. boy. Ooh. Sorry, that was my bad. Oh my he God. loves to sit and sleep in the boxes. So that's this the spot. is this is one of his spots here. My mouth is full of cat hair. Yeah. <laughs> my face. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, you're still hanging out, big man? Nice kitties. Are Very you good. um Hi. What can we do for you, big man? Hi, Moose Chair. Other than eat your hair. <laughs> you snuggling man? Oh, goodbye, little man. Goodbye. Goodbye, little buddy. Cat yeah, he's a big man. He's a big man. He's a very big man. Were you talking about how it was my birthday this Friday? This past Friday? Why did this light go out? Hello? Oh my god. Did the thing just pop out? Yeah, that might have been it. I just stared into the light now. You gotta change. You gotta, oh, you didn't pack her away yet. She's, uh, mm -hmm. she's still in the works. I need to find her... Happy birthday, Token! Extra pieces. Happy birthday! This is the God Gundam. Yeah, <laughs> finding her parts is gonna be rough. Or We've not. got a bag of so many parts. Yeah, okay, bear with me, gang. Okay, I had two little pieces here there. I think I still need to sand these. Little man's taking a bath in his little box. That'd be me! I've been meaning to catch one of your streams. Timing just never works out. Oh. It's a pleasure to meet you. Thank you for coming what? in. It's very nice to meet you. It's always exciting when you follow someone on social media yeah. and then you're like, oh my god, <laughs> they're real. Yeah. <laughs> I do recognize some of the names when they come in for the first time. Look at these stickers. What are these? Those were for stands, so they came in like an action stand Boom. six or something. Mm -hmm. But instead, <laughs> because we don't have um, we don't have Gundams built for each of these characters. I've just been using the stands for our 30 minute missions. Like, look, this is one right here. Yeah. Because I didn't want to have one or two and not have the full stack. I'm kind of weird like that. If I'm going to do it, I, I feel like I need to do it right and have one for everybody. Found her. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> That's such a menacing bag. Kablamo. It's just empty faces with empty eyes. I really, really enjoyed this. I talked about maybe doing her as a comp piece, but I would probably paint her- The one with the gun tank instead? Different colors. But for it being our first competition, I think focusing on one kit is probably for the best and just doing the best I can, especially if I've never entered one before. I think just starting off smaller is probably you know, oh no, I did the thing where I cut out a piece and then uh, immediately lose that piece. Oh my god, what did I do to her arm? That's one thing I don't oh. know. I'm not huge on these kits. They're joints. Their joints aren't as good as the 30 minute sister's joints, I would say. Look at, what did I do? Um, also, do you see a red piece that's not this red piece? Because I lost one. <laughs> oh no! A red piece that's not that one? Yeah, it's almost like a triangle. It's this piece here. This one. I, uh, have misplaced it. And our focus is also off because I was uh -oh, talking about spaghettios. Oh no. Oh no. It's like one of this- Oh, it's right there. Oh, you found it? Seven. Where? Oh. oh, I don't know if I can reach that. I can if you just- Wait. Okay, well, she's going for it. Don't fall. I just had to, to, to die. Hi, Emma Wes. Hello. Onimo is packing another one. Packed away. We're going to be so packed. Dude, we're going to be so packed in Jack. We're going to be packing. Okay. Which way does this go? It doesn't really show you the orientation. I'm going to guess it's this way. Well, so will the cat stay for the whole stream? Pretty much. Now Once that he's, he's in the box, he's, he's he kind of moves in. He's got a little, little fluffy. He pretty much will stay there all stream now. Because he knows if he stays, he likes to be waka, involved waka, and he also gets snacks. Waka 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 waka. Red and Shippy, thank you! Thank you! I've been lurking for a while and you guys have really inspired me to tackle my backlog! Yay! Thank you, Red. Thank you for that prime. Thank you so Thanks much. Super duper. Thank you for coming to hang out too. You've been lurking. We appreciate it. Yes. Thank you very much. We appreciate the lurkers, the quiet ones. Oh, I love this guy. I'm so sad to see him get packed up so early. I love this guy. This is the oh, why don't you see multi legs. Him? I am actually <laughs> to him. 
This is my fiance. I love this 30 minute mission kit. I, I think love him so much. I think it's my favorite one so far. Yeah. I think previously Easily. we were obsessed with the Spinadios and the Spinadias. Love this. They've love started him. releasing images for the Armored Core 6 models for the 30 minute missions. Yeah. And I'm really excited to see those too. I love this guy. They released more images for the 30 minute fantasy line. They had a couple announcements last week. We're eating good tonight. I hope Damn. they all come to Canada because they're 30 minute missions. Yeah. I don't think they do 30 minute missions or 30 minute sisters as like P Bandai, so I think we're pretty safe to fall in love yeah. with these. Okay. Um, yeah, I got this for my birthday. Um, birthday. From Homie Glenn. I'm Glenner. Um, huge. Love this guy. Can't wait to paint him. Who knows when that will be? He will be painted as Parasect Pokemon. Is that not so fitting and perfect? Little Man just kind of like fades into the abyss that is his box. Like, you see what I mean? Yeah, he can't even really tell that he's here. Good morning, happy spring season. Good morning. Smiley. Thank you, Alfie. Um, this is where I can question. See. Here we go. This guy doesn't have an extra bits bag. No. He didn't come with any. He did not. So I can just put him yes. in there? Um, I don't think he needs to be in a bag per se. The bag is just helpful in case while they're moving certain things fall yes. out, then you kind of know who they belong to. I will Sir, kinda... that is not- you're, <laughs> you're coming out of your zone here. I'm compacting him. What are you doing? He's all curled up and he's going gonna, into here. You're gonna lay in some nubs and mommy needs her these. Can I make sure you're not on any nubs? Oh, good boy. Okay, let me get these out of the way. Oh god. I know, and it's okay, it's okay, you can come back down. We've packed four away. He did not like that. Do you have the cat treats? Can I give him a peace offering? <laughs> He's got a crazy bedhead. Well, that's a little one. That's okay. Little snackums. A little peace offering for getting- Well, now there's no nubs in your space, and you can lay down here if you want. Whoa, is that super, mister? Isn't that so nice now? Well, Okay, yeah, he's, he's settled back in. Look at it. He- he just- you can't even tell he's there. Yep. Until you get the <laughs> until you get the eyes, he is a void what until he looks at? out of the camera. Sometimes he will stare directly into yeah. the camera. Yeah, on occasion he remembers you guys are there and he'll just look at you. Yeah, and he stares into your souls like he knows you're there. It's yeah. so creepy. It's kind of funny. It's hilarious because he's a goofball, <laughs> but it's like, what are he's you looking goofball. at? What do you see? What was that Tell me your square secrets. thing? This is a little desk vacuum. So I am obsessed with this little desk vacuum because I get nubs all over the space when I'm building. I just build on top of a desk so they fall onto the mat. And the cats walk through the build area so frequently that it's just a little vacuum. You turn it on, you suck up all the nubs. So there's, there's one here, but it gets rid of all of the nubs. And it's not overly loud, it's USB chargeable. Non-sponsored, I just really like this fun little Amazon. toy. So you. It was like $25 on Amazon. I highly recommend it if you are annoyed by nubs getting everywhere. Yes, and it- and I'm sure it, it works with other hobbies too, like if you're crafty with other things. It's su such a quick like- Oh, if I'm eating chips and it gets all over the desk, I just- <laughs> like, it's, it's so, so easy. It's so handy. <laughs> oh, it's the best And then you don't thing. have to like get a cloth or like clean it up or like try to get it all into your hand and throw it out. You just suck it all suck up it and all then up. empty it into the garbage. Oh yeah, like yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Thank you for the follow. Thank you, Jiba. Thank you. Hello, hello. Everyone's just here for Loki, and I'm totally Pokemon okay with that. Yeah. <laughs> purple came in. Loki is the Lord of Darkness. Hi, purple. Does it really do a good job? Bird soup. It does a great job. It does job. a great job. No. Oh, there's, there's nubs. nubs in the box. Nubs in the box. Speaking of nubs, you little got man. Some nubs. Where you go, little little stinky? <sighs> little stinky dum dum. Little stinky was on the run. Hey, hey, you can't have this box. I know it's bigger and nicer than that one, but you can't have it. Oh, he's gonna fight for it. <laughs> he wants it so bad. Oh my god. <laughs> he's not the most graceful. <laughs> no grace. All beauty, no grace. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there you go again. You hello, can't have it. hello, hello. He's uh, he's gonna make the rounds. You he's, can't have this either. He's hunting. I'm putting other things. No, no. Hi, Garrett. Hello, Cowabunga sisters. Hello. Hey, Garrett. Hello, hello. 
I think our schedule from now on should be more normal. Yes, I have to take this off. It's. I think, I think the worst of it is past. Are you being a troublemaker? Trouble yes. Maker. I'm getting. Is um, true. I'm oh. getting a bunch of messages from the realtor. Sure, I'm, uh, I'm streaming with my friends right now. Mister. Okay. No. No. <laughs> Is he trying to get into the box again? No. You could give him the top lid. Like, not the one with the nubs in it. Oh, are you gonna go back to yours? Just no. Go, just go into your box. Display case. Why are you this way? Konbawa, sisters. Hello. What do you... I really Please hold. <laughs> did like um, the MG... The H. Oh yeah, oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. No, you can, this is a He's this fighting. is a Gundam head. Why do you do this? Whoa. Why do you do this? Norm, thank you very much. Thank you for that follow. Welcome to the sisterhood. Can you leave it? Can you go into your box? <laughs> Loki owns oh, the box. Oh, he has no eating He's it. He's trying to eat them. Oh my god. What are you eating? There's no. That's a file. This is glass. Okay. He's laid down. He has decided to. Try I'm, to eat everything on the desk. I'm getting one thank you for the what info. No problem, bird soup. I'm what sure there's doing? different colors too. If they had a blue one, I'd get blue. <sighs> blue or black. He's laying right beside his box. How goes the building? Um, there's very little building tape you can put- Not a whole lot right now! Stop beating them up! Brother! Is, the, is it still put together or did he- I think so. What is happening? Hey, this is mummy's space. Why, when did this become your space? No, you can't- you can't have this. <laughs> Can I? Good to see you, kids. Good to see you. What Don't are you look doing? Cat tree. You guys are going to enable this behavior? You guys behavior? are enabling bad behavior. Bad. You guys are bad. Just as bad as he is. This is why he is a menace because is, chat requests way. it. Kid, you gotta, you gotta look at, you gotta look at chat to come get the oh. snacky. Oh, attack! Attack them. Good job, mister. <laughs> He's gonna get all up in your business. Did you find an apartment? Things are in the works. Things are happening. <sighs> We're doing our best. We are doing our best. I have a pretty good lay of the land now. I know how much things go for. Oh, it's stressful. Yeah. If that's about as I... funny as the time it took the bag of treats and left oh and then God. came back. I yeah. love that. He was He just was, took it and was like, this is mine now. He's like, this is mine, and then he got out and realized he's like, but I can't open this by myself. So he brought it back. So he brought it back <laughs> in to be like, uh, can you guys open this for me, please? Thank <laughs> Actually, you. Actually, I realized the air in my ways. <laughs> yes. That was so funny. Cora is here, she's under the bed. Mm -hmm. Um Sometimes she comes out and wanders around. You were looking very professional today, Smiley. Thank you. Professional. Maybe he wants This to... is the first time I've worn makeup in three weeks. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to end a bag of treats and leaves the room. Yep. I always enable him. Yeah, you do. You guys are naughty. He simply loves the aerial. <laughs> I respect his good <laughs> taste. Do you know what? I didn't consider it that way. I didn't think about it that way. Good morning. I'm actually taking a break from house Hello. cleaning to work on RX-78 Toolkit. That's such a fun cleaning break to be like, you know what? I've done enough for now. Yeah. I'm going to build. Spring cleaning. Um, I'm going to have a... Grab yourself a, a bevy. Hydrate. Grab yourself... Oh, I'm holding it. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> where are you going? Grab yourself a tea or a coffee or, or whatever you, you enjoy. Yeah, it's the weekend. It's time on to this, relax. On this lovely day, take a break from cleaning. Build a little kit. Why not? That sounds so nice. On this lovely day, she says there's snow on my front lawn. Yeah, but look at the sky. It's the first clear blue sky in like it's two weeks. It's the first day we haven't had snow since the official first day of spring. And there's no clouds? Yeah, it snowed on the first day of spring like a blizzard. It basically snowed every day the first week of spring. Yeah, and so it's it's so sunny out. Okay, this goes Lovely. here. You are minus two pack gunpla. What do you mean? Yeah, you're falling behind on your redeems, ma'am. 
Oh, I see this one, but I got the other ones. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five. We should be at five out of sixty-five. Okay, so I've only missed this You've one. You've missed one. Okay. And it just happened. Guys, c come on. Chill out. I'm you getting You can here. also uh, open up the redeem thing and track it and that. Oh, I could do that. Just so you know how many you've you've gone through. Is that this one? No. That's um on the Twitch. So I open Twitch? the Chrome. And then go oh. to... This one? Yeah, you can... Right. Bottom right. Circle. Click. And then click on pack a gumpla or whichever one you want. Okay, beauty. I also grabbed the truck nuts when I didn't need to. So one, two, three, four, five. You've packed one, two, three, four. Yes, I've packed four. One, two, three. I'm keeping track. There's six there. Six? Purple. Damn, purple caught you out. You are negative two. Purple? Can you relax? I'm getting there. So All mark right. off the four that you've done. One, two, three, four. Now, I'm sure we have a bag. Um, uh, did you want me to do this? Oh yeah, I should probably build shit. <laughs> yeah. I should do what I'm supposed to I do when I'm here. here. Complete these. But you're also looking through bags, so I didn't know how much stuff okay. you've got to do. So I'll do these two. I just need to find the Herbitos bag. The third. The dual blitz and light. Well, I don't know if I know what the lightning buster is. I know the dual and the blitz. Lightning buster sounds badass. Mm -hmm. I wish I could see you guys build the new RX 78 2, 2.0 kit. We have a 3.0 kit, but we don't have the new 2.0 kit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hi. I don't know where you left off. I'm gonna let you. I'll catch up. Oh. I'm in Texas. We all know I decided we pray for the call. Mr. This Queen ain't Magic Texas. Eraser is the easiest clean. No, hold them. <laughs> easiest way to clean up panel liner pass along. Is it really? What is? The Mr. Clean Magic Eraser is good for pipe panel lines. I mean, That's it can clean anything. That's true. It, it is the magic eraser. Whatever Mr. Clean is selling, I'm buying. Yeah. That's a big one. That's a wing. Who are you looking for? Meme Redeem Doctor! Hi, Doc. Good to see you, Doc. I'm looking for Barbatos, but I'm not sure if we have a Barbatos bag or not. This looks we like a should. I would think so. Because Barbatos would have a weapon somewhere. But if he's... It what, also if, if could he was be early loose enough, somewhere. If he was early enough, is he here? Was I? Oh, I'm not supposed to Do put that assault, on SD. No, there's no Barbatos here. Ah, uh, uh, yes. Because his there. weapon is right here. Not in a bag. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Nightingale. Yeah, that's his weapon there. So if it's not in a bag, that means he doesn't have one. Yeah. Good. Okay, just checking. V4. Just checking. Um, he likes to fall apart a little bit, so I might put him in a bag. Mm -hmm. If I have one. Yenor. That makes sense. I wish I could see you guys building the new- I already got that Oh, one. you got it? That would be a good one. The chaos of spare parts. There's so many. There should definitely- I should organize these better instead of just tossing them all into baggies and then yeeting them into that. I'm putting him in the spare stands. <laughs> okay. He goes in here, because at least everything will stand out. Ha! But it's- You're welcome. I'm great. <laughs> great. Oh, and I didn't even show him. Oh my god, I was too busy looking for him. Hold on. He was like one of the first full custom paints that I did. So I'll show him up. Everybody, 
You know them, you love them. The Barbatos. This was from Little Sugar Bear. Little Sugar Bear, thank you. Painted him as a bear, of course, because he was a little, little sugar, sugar bear. Painted him, he's the Barbatos. He has his big old bear paws. His big old bear paws. He has his little ears and a little bow tie, a little fluffy bow tie. Painted him all brown, brown and gold. A little texture, it's hard to see. I don't want to mess with your focus. But you can still see it a bit. There he is. Looking stunning. Here's the very first one. Away you go. Bye. Goodbye. See you next time. Did you pack the Exia yet? Doctor, what a wonderful thing to ask. He's going to be number 65. Assuming she counted correct and there are indeed 65. Unless I lie to you and never show him. So I've done six now. Or no, I haven't. I've done one, two, three, four, five. five. I have to do purples. And that one that just came in. This goes. Bear necessities. Just Absolutely. Bear Onimaru! Necessities. He's, Onimaru is the one that is packing away the majority. Onimaru is keeping Onimaru. us honest. Ooh, Nine Industries. Thanks for the tip. Thank you. Okay, who's next? You, because I've packed away your sister. Daisy. Commander Daisy. F1. This was... Smiley built this one much uh, earlier than I built mine. But she's a, a gun girl lady. Daisy. She's the edgier one. Mine was uh, very colorful. The edgy fur coat. Yeah, she gives me like biker vibes. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure. I'm assuming you have your own bag for her. Probably, because she had a decent amount of spare parts. I don't think Peanut can count. Do you know what? She you tries. Might, <laughs> I, I try. You might be onto something, though. I cannot confirm nor deny if I can count. Hello Kitty. Nor. That's Lacus. It's the bare necessities as in bare necessities. Forget about your worries and your strife. Something, 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 something. I'm picking this out because it's so freaking huge. Packing gunpla for a move gives me nightmares. <laughs> yeah. The head is so cute. Yeah. What a unique looking, like, profile. Kind of is. You're the Hello Kitty. You're. Wait a minute. A something or other. You're a something. Straight turn red. Oh, is this her? No. No, it should have like creepy looking faces in the bag. Yeah. That's the Lacus. That's Lacus. Hmm. Is it in this box? Maybe. In the box full of. That's Other... got a bunch of like 30 minute sisters stuff in there. Because I imagine I would have kept all her faces and stuff. Maybe it's somewhere in there. Okay, head done. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Moving on to some feetsies. D runner. Let's see. I see a booty in here, a spare booty. Where's all her spare stuff? I wonder what I did with her. No. I don't see it. Did you not keep them? Well, if I did, they're not here. I guess you'll have to pick. I can put them in this girl bag. Unless I put all of their. No, because she would have had extra black hands. 
you know? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Troubling. Indubitably. Ask us a question. That was six. Is this one number six? This is number six. So I have one more to do after this. Nope. Don't do it. That's the... That's fresh. Okay. We still have to do one more. Ask us a question is done. There. You can just leave it on here now to see all of the new incoming requests. So we don't lose anything. Until I find her bag, they are going together. They are sisters. <laughs> I've decided for them. I have that decided they, they are related now. I'm definitely going to find that bag somewhere and be like, oh, this is where it was. Every time there's a pair, even if it's clearly not gendered, they're sisters. I don't care. They're sisters. They're going together. <laughs> One, two, three. Okay. Another one? Maybe Another I'll pick one. one that I know there's a bag. Yeah, that makes sense. There's also some that instead of a bag, they're in that uh, thing at the bottom. Yes. Oh! I know she. Uh oh. Ow! Oh! I dropped oh, a yeah, piece oh, and then yeah. I put the microphone. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Is that what oh, yeah. Yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, I dropped yeah. a piece. I went down to look at My hair caught the microphone and pulled it. This is garbage. I need, there's a, like, a gray piece somewhere that I just launched. Oh, God. And that's what I was looking for when I fought the microphone. <laughs> Is it light? Dark? It's this color. Okay. And it's, um, oh, God. it's fairly big. Large? Yeah. Really large? Like the size of a nickel. Hello? A nickel? Yeah, I think it would be about the size of a nickel. Okay, I'm coming to help. Oh, there it is. Oh, you found it? Okay, nice. You schmooved and I found it. Oh my gosh. Oh, waku waku. <laughs> waku waku. Waku waku. Thank you. Waku waku. Thank you. That's very, very nice. Do you all thank you. Thank you. Enjoy those thank you, um, thank you. goofy emotes. Okay, she has a bag. Oh, Nimora. Wow, mic check. Sorry, I didn't mean to headbutt Sorry. you guys. It was a total accident. Did that like reverberate? Oh my goodness. Sup, Smiley, sup, Peanut, sup, Chat. Hi, oshi -san. What's going on? Hello, hello. I heard that mic drop. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it wasn't even a cool mic drop. You know how people no. like drop it for Boom. effect? Yeah. I just slapped my head on everyone's ears. You did. Um, it's oh my not. God, I found it. <laughs> Where? Wh what? I don't know. Okay, you're not sisters anymore. Oh. oh, okay. You can be. Besties. They're not all gonna fit in that bag. You're gonna have to put them in different bags. Like, can you? <laughs> Her it's one job temporary. was to pack Gundams for the move. It's and temporary. They're like overflowing from this already. It's temporary. Mm, 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 mm. I gotta catch up before I start worrying Hydrate. about other stuff. Give me more stuff Boink. Boink. Mm. Thank you very much. Whole lot of nada. Still waking up. Still taking it easy. It's just afternoon for us here. So we're doing an earlier stream. If I do offers on houses for certain days, normally the deadline to put in the offers are between like five and seven. So we're streaming a little bit early today so that I still have offer time later in the evening. Oh, it's exciting and stressful all at once. This is the next one to pack, the Sienna Marcia. Sienna Marcia, shark girl and lava boy. Oh, we need a lava boy. We do need a lava boy. She was Damn super it. cute. I enjoyed painting her just accenting, giving some metallic. Yeah, you loved this kid. I love her. She's beautiful. She's a shark. Oh, I grabbed the wrong runner. I think she's adorbs. This one? Her little jellyfish things. Very cute. She is so cute. I love adding metallic though. A little a little hint of metallic. A little bit of like pizzazz. And I love her little neck piece. Can we can we <laughs> enhance? Look at her little neck piece. It's so cute. Okay. Gives like Haro vibes. Very much so. Yeah. Fish Haro. Oh, and her head fell off. Sorry. It's hard to believe that when I look over and you're like manhandling her and I'm like, did it fall off? It fell or, off. Like... I didn't touch it. I took her stand off. Such a chill channel. I hope many people will support this channel more. But 
thank you. That's very kind. Thank you so much. That is very sweet. That is very kind. Thank you. We just kind of come to hang out and spend time with y'all. Thank you. We, we can really only do this because of you guys. So thank you. You guys are the chill ones. You are the ones that make it chill. I'm That's gonna true. Give you... I feel like our biggest motivation to stream is to come hang out with a very chill chat and like... Yes. Just talk to everybody. Yeah. If you guys weren't chill, we would If it was chill. us just spending time together with sisters, I'd be like, oh my god, I have to hang out with Peanut again. Oh my god. It would not be chill. <laughs> Are you going to get any of the 30 minute fantasy kits later this year? I oh, would love you... to. Do we have a launch date for those yet? I bet, yeah. I was looking at the 30 minute fantasy announcements and the armored core announcements. So I'm curious to see when they're going to come to market and then when they're going to come to the Canadian market on top of that. Because we don't always get things at the same time. Sometimes we get things like a month later. There's a bit of a delay sometimes. Oh, good night, Char and Amuro sisters. <laughs> Glad to see you again on stream. Have a great morning day, you both of you adorable cats. Thank you, Thank Neil. You. Sorry, I only just saw that now. Good night. Have a good sleep. Oyasumi. Oyasumi. Guten Nacht. Buenas noches. Oh, okay. I think I'm working on the feetsies now. Feetsy pieces. Okay, so I have one, the footsies. Three, four, five, six, seven. Seven down. No. Still plenty to go, but we're making some headway. Seven down and caught up. Nice. Yeah, there's a lot to pack up. So I just finished packing Gundams on stream. Would kind of be the most fun way to go about doing it. Did you give me these? No, you definitely did not give me these. Where the hell did these come from? In here? Um, extra parts from... For 30 minute. From Ilshana. Probably. What a weird superpower. When you've built enough that you can look at a runner and identify, like, where yeah. the frick these came from. I'm, I think I took them out of this box. Because I found her. Like, Because with Ilshana, we also had the optional clothing yes. pack that we did. Yeah. So the original and the extra. And yeah. the additional. We did get a parts. meme redeem. Do you have one on your phone you'd like to share? Or do you have one on the pooter? Um, I saw one that I thought was really funny. Let me grab it for y'all. Funny haha -ha or funny weird? <laughs> funny haha. -ha. I think this one's funny haha. -ha. Let me see. I gotta find it again. One second. Getting some of the air out of these bags. Okay, this one was posted on the Gundam Bros Twitter. Runner sense is tingling. Yeah. Look at this guy, he looks like a little dried up cicada. Sorry. Sorry, one sec. Okay, this was from the Gundam Bros Twitter and it was shared to us by Cyber Rain. Let me change the focus here. Which way is the focus? Ooh, this way? blurry. I'm pretty sure I saw a Gundam in this area, bro. You see? Negative. It's just... <laughs> you oh, were half you reading it outside and then you gave up. <laughs> like, what the fuck? I can't read. I can't read. Oh. Oh. That's I'm cute. pretty sure I saw a Gundam in this area, bro. You seen one? Negative. It's just me here. And then he lifts his helmet. It's a Gundam! Then he puts it back down. Oh, it's just you again. The Gobo was here a moment ago. Yeah, interesting. interesting. Because I'm such like a Fetty fan, stuff like this I find funny because I'm like, haha, stupid Zeon, you couldn't figure it out. Stupid you stinky, stinky Zeon. Stinky brain. Zeon. <laughs> okay, this box of my little spider boy is all filled up. And he's not even in here. This is full. That's, yeah, that's. 
That's full. And I want to be very careful like how I stack them too. Yes, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put all the Gundam boxes in one bigger box. I so that it's only all. like Gundams on top of Gundams kind of thing and it yeah. keeps them a little bit safer. I staggered them. I gotta staggered open the, the chat back up again. Full! My little cicada boy is still vibing. Boop. Hey, question for Peanut. No! <laughs> Have you heard of uh, Labrella for dog joints? If so, would you recommend it? Yes, I have. We give Labrella at um, uh, the hospital I work at all the time. Basically, like every single day. Um, and we have noticed a difference. We've noticed a huge difference, mainly in large breed dogs that have more weight on their joints. Um, I mean, always talk to your veterinarian about it, but we always ask, hey, how's how's Fluffy doing this month? Because it's a monthly injection. We're like, how are they doing? And people have noticed a difference like earliest two to three weeks after the first injection. Owners have noticed a difference where their old dog is now not just lying down. Like they're a little bit more active. They're running up the stairs again. They're, they're running to the door to greet you when you get home. They're playing in the backyard. Those are kind of the quality of life updates that we're getting. And we've had it for like maybe half a year to up to a year now, because it only recently came to Canada. Um, but we've, we've heard there's, there's been a big difference. I don't have a dog, <laughs> so I, don't, I can't really give a personal anecdote, but from what we've heard, we've heard great things. And there's also the cat equivalent where people are getting it for their senior cats and they're playing again and they're running and they're jumping and we actually have to be like, okay, slow down. You're a senior citizen. <laughs> you can't be doing this. Don't hurt yourself. But it's because they feel so much better where they're like, nope, I can do all of this again. <laughs> I'm like, oh my God. Chokes on you. <laughs> yeah. So yes. Ask your veterinarian if it is right for you, or your dog, not for you. We've been having lunch and learns recently. At work? Yes. Which is when like a representative from a company will come in and talk to us about a, a new product or why, if we use their products, why we should continue doing that. Nice to meet you, it's Korea. Hi, Hi Korea. Hello. Um, annyeonghaseyo. Um, and there was last year, there was like a flea and tick medication. And at the end we played Kahoot. Do you know what Kahoot is? Mm -hmm. I, it was so fun. I named myself one of my coworkers and I lost <laughs> terribly. And it was so funny. And so they came back again this year and I was like, oh my God, I'm so excited. I hope we play Kahoot. And it was on the, the opening slide of the presentation. And I was like, yes. But then we ran out of time and we didn't get to play. I was so upset. I was ready to lose again. Whenever there's a Kahoot at the end of like a corporate training I'm attending, I'm like, oh, son of a bitch, they got me. They gamified it. I have to win now. I'm I so fucking to. competitive. As soon as yeah. I know there's a leaderboard and I can dominate said leaderboard, yep. I give it my all. I go from not wanting to pay attention and learn a single thing to being like, you're going down, Shelly. Yeah, you're going down, Shelly. I'm going to beat your ass. <laughs> no, I feel that. Gamify anything and I'm all in. I feel that. Oh, cool. We use... Carprovet SP in the vet tech at my vet's office suggested. He said it's only been out six months to a year. Yeah, I mean, hey, um, it's out there. It's it's making waves. So it is ultimately your decision, of course. But it is it's very cool. Hello, wonderful siblings. Mom. Hi. I hear a cat at the feeder, and I'm wondering if it's Cora. Is there a little baby meow meow? There better be. I do love a, a baby meow meow. You oh. want a treat? You want a treat? She gives it. Come on, come on. She's looking. Come on, sweetie. Oh, do you want me to come get you? Yes, baby, baby. Come on. Oh my god, the baby. The sweet lady. 
okay. Hey, look, we're gonna give you snackies for your. Hi, sweetie. Mm -hmm. What's okay? Here, what if I put it down for you? Do you wanna put it on the chair so she'll. Yay, sweet lady. What if I put it here so that people can see your cute little face? No, don't run. Ah, the lady. Look at all these snackies you're getting. Oh, oh, okay. I'll just get another one. Is that one gone? Ah, oh, Cora, you just kind of see your little tail. Okay. Whoa, that was so good. Ooh. Oh, you're doing little tricks. Good girl. She's so gentle. I wonder if I can show her to to chat. Are you gonna let me? Oh, oh good oh, jump. Oh, oh, oh. Good jump. Okay, come say hi. Ooh. Oh, she's so skittish. Okay, honey girl. She likes the flat hand. She likes it like this. This is this is lady. Mm -hmm. This is lady. Do this. This is Cora. Oh my gosh, she's had so many treats. I know. I'll I'll, I'll slow down. Yeah. She's very skittish still, so mostly because Cotton's been kind of tricky with her. Yeah. Look at you, you coming to explore. Are you gonna go hide in your spot? Wow. That's okay. Girl. Oh, but she still wants the tree. Well, you've had so many, I don't want you to throw up. She's like, I'm scared and I don't want to be here, but I see that you have a bag of treats but with you. But actually, trade offer, I give you my presents, you give me snacks. Good girl. Oh, good girl. But I don't have snack -ums. I don't have any snack Look at you being so good. You're being so brave. She's so brave. She's well behaved. Oh, I can't pull my chair and I got a little lady under my chair. Everybody chill the fuck out. Okay. Cotton don't got the riz? Cotton? <sighs> no, he th he's one of those guys that's like, where's my hug at? They've, and Loki's lately been trying to like play with her a little bit and she's not super having it. Yeah. So. Oh, that's a good hmm. girl. You sniffing? Can I? Whoa, he's being so brave right now. <laughs> Only because the boys aren't here. Only because the cats aren't. I enjoyed the last interview video. Thank you! That was a lot of fun to do. We had a really good time. You like the window? Do you want to go to the window, honey? Whoa. Do you want to go her. see the window? Look at her. Yeah, I did want to go to the window. She okay. walks so slowly because she's so nervous. Do you want to go see the window? Oh. Wow. Good girl. Oh, she didn't go in. Whoa. Oh, Con is like loafed in right outside the door. Oh, God. Like in the hallway, he's right there. Hello, baby Cora. Yes, yeah, she is a sweet baby Hello, angel. Hello, sweet girl. There she goes. There she is. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, if you move that, will she walk? Oh, no. She's, she's made up her mind. She's going that way. Oh, she's like a. Okay, careful. Big man's right there. She walks. Okay, so if a cat is looking at her, she walks at Sandman speed, assuming that because she's moving so slowly, nobody can see her. <laughs> she's going slow. <laughs> she walks at a turtle's pace, trying to go past the other cats. Oh my gosh, it's the cutest thing. But I'm like, honey, they can still see you. Like, yeah. I can see what you did there. She's so sweet. <laughs> yeah, she's so, so sweet. She is a sweetie. Okay, I have to pack another one away. Mm -hmm. But we had to take our time with Miss Cora. The little lady. The little lady. You being good over there, mister? <laughs> Maybe. You being good to her? Is he just laying and watching? Yeah, he hasn't moved. Be a good boy. He's normally pretty good, but he definitely has times where he wants to play. Yeah. Yeah, Cotton certainly don't have that riz. He wishes he did. Earthquake. Oh gosh, I have to pack two of them away. All right, this is the Ilshana. She's got a pair of scissors. She's the ookie spooky, ookie spooky ookie gal. Spooky. She has a lot of extra pieces. 
She was fun to build too. I like that she had so much like variation to her. I like that you're targeting the waifu shell first, basically. They were just so easy and I know where their bags are. <laughs> um, I guess I'll put these runners with her. Or do we wanna what do we wanna do with this? I wanna keep all of these extra waifu like stuff in one bag because it just makes it easiest. Like in one in the box. Oh, okay. So maybe it's easier to get like either additional sandwich baggies to put a couple of the waifus in or to just leave them free roaming. Yeah. Okay. Well, I will put her in this bag. I put a couple waifus in the other box. Do you want me to move them? No, it's okay. Okay. But I think for the most part I'll keep it like this. Okay. This is relatively... Oh, I can see if I can pack that away in there. Did one, and now we'll do another. <laughs> Noise. Thank you, Jiba. I'll do another one. Maybe I'll do Lacus, because I see hers as well. She dropped her little Haro. Lacus! Was she one of our first, like, anime figures? Yes. She was Yes, she was. First. There she is. Because aside from her, I've got a Sasuke, we've got a Goku. She, um... She's pretty nice quality. I really like her, her full skirt. Very nice quality. We had built a 30-minute sister before building her, but... The new 30 minute sister is like the idle ones. The yes. skirts and things, I think they built off of what they learned with Lacus. Yeah. Because a lot of the 30 minute sisters kits before the idle ones were, were bodysuit oriented for the most part. There she is, she's got her little Haro. She comes with a stand, which is nice. There's her big old skirt. Pull this out. Ordered the Lacus Windbreaker from P Bandai. Super excited! Windbreaker? Yeah, that sounds lit. That does sound pretty good. I love me a good windbreaker. If I can have Lacus Klein on it too, sign me up. That'd be pretty cool. Here she is. Pack her up. My body says I should play more. My hands are cold after. Um, my, my <laughs> controller down. Gotta warm up, uh, gotta get the blood flowing, gotta play some more. Circulation. I've been playing a lot of the new Stardew Valley update. Is it out already? It is. I've heard that they recommend you start over. Is that what you did or no? That is what I did. Because I had um, the expanded mod on, so I've been playing unmodded and I started over. Before I jumped into it, I watched a stream of someone playing it mm -hmm. from scratch to kind of see if it would be worth starting over. Yeah. And there's quite a lot of new stuff that was added, so I was like, okay, I'm gonna go in the way it was intended. I'm gonna start a new farm. And it's been pretty good. Her skirt is so large, I don't know if it's gonna fit in this box. You might need to put her in a different box. Uh, yeah, I think I will have to. She'll have to go in this deep one down here. Okay, and I have to do another one. I'm at almost 100 hours in Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. That's a lot of hours. Hmm. Why does this not look correct? What have I done here? Maybe I'll do one up here. God Gundam? Noble, relax. Why does this not seem to be correct? 
What have I done here? The God Gundam? Look at this glorious, glorious piece. Look at him. Boink, boink, boink. I love this pose he's in, and I'm very sad to take him out of it. Because you have like the footwork down. He looks so good. Yeah, he does. This is one of my favorite ones that you've you've built. Posed? Oh. And posed. Like all of the above. It just looks so good. Why is this not? What a beautiful kit. Now that's Gunpei. Hmm. Zero. What have I done here? This doesn't have anything. This doesn't have a label. Is this one of the um, MGs? Is this one of the Astrays? Do you think? Is this an Astray bag? That's either the Kai. No, that's definitely the Astray. Yeah. Red frame. That's the red frame. This is the turn red. So that's the red frame. new. I really hope they announce more G Gundam kids during the anniversary stream in April. He's so damn cool. He looks really, really good. I put this on this way instead. Give us an HG of every country. I agree. Imagine the nether. That would be so fun. This is Batman. God Gundam! Found it. I'm going to have to take you out of your pose, mister. I'm so Is sorry. Is that the uh, HG bag or the RG bag? It just says God Gundam. Is this HG? Depends what's in the bag. What color hands are in the bag? That's the HG. The RG bag has yellow hands in the bag. Or like orangey colored hands in the bag. Oh, that's right. Hello. Oh, is this you? Yeah, this is you. God Gundam. Found you. Runner check. Where was? The these are my tiny Two little F runners. Ago. These ones are nice, these like metallic -y ones. Yeah, I like the metallic. They look really detailed. C runner, I think a lot of these are gonna be for the legs that I'm working on. D runners. E. E. B's pretty close to being done. I pause. What's going on? I pause. A runner. Only has a little bit of yellow left. We're getting there. We getting there. Still on the feetsies though. 15 and 16 up next. These tiny little babies up here. be hard to pack because I don't want things to get damaged in transport no. you know but I can do it up most of the way and just have that stick out a little bit mm -hmm. okay got gun um goodbye oh oh have all this stuff boink boink what oh uh oh what was that technical difficulty We've gotten better at changing off of it a lot quicker. Okay. Packed away. 
one. I think it's I think it's working. Can you check me? Fixed. Good old turn it off and turn it back on again worked. Thank goodness. It's been a while since we've had that uh, issue pop up. Mm -hmm. digits. We're at 10? We're at 10. Holy shit. 10 packs Why do away. we still have so many left? Because <laughs> there's 65. There's a lot. There's a lot to get through. 5, 6. Dang. Way to go, chat. You guys are really packing us up. Yep, we're at 10. This was probably the most fun way to pack. I'm enjoying this. Okay, I'm caught up. Whew! My goodness. target <laughs> I think I got up to like 64 and then added one just to be safe okay so this could be included already both of them are so cool but if I had to pick one of the two which would you like better what are the options of which kids which options I've gone through and talked about so many of them as I'm putting them away are we talking about God Gundams? HGRG? Let me know. SSU Pla? I can't count that high. I can hardly count that high. Let's go back. Packing another away. I'd like to get the ones off of the shelves so I can yeah, take the shelves down. Two. You've already taken a lot out of the display case. Who are... You had the, uh, the god gun in a second ago. The god gun in the bag. <coughs> Ooh. I need to find you again. Where did I put you? Ooh. Okay, next time you open the display case, be careful, because everything oh, might come out of the top shelf. Oh, good. <laughs> Just a heads up. Where did I put the bag? Is it one of these ones up here? No, it's this one. Oh, the God Gundam. Um, the stand? What would you like me to do with the stand? It might have to be disassembled so that it fits in a box. Yeah. I'm so proud of this one. I was in, um, I was in Epo's stream the other day. Cause anytime Epo's on, I either turn it on and just lurk, or I'll, I'll pop in and say hello if I have time to say hello. Bless you, thank you. And Ipo was like, I went back and I watched or saw a clip and the way you were looking at the HG God gun that you'd painted, you looked like a proud mother. Like you were so proud of the paint and everything. And I'm like, that is so true. Cause this is the one I'm most proud of. And it is the most it's recent. It's your most recent one too. So you're just learning as you go. Yes. And so you're evolving. I really made progress with this one. But this is the HG God painted in hyper mode. This um, one's a gift from Kitbash Cody. Yes, this was from Cody. I love the ombre color that I did. I feel like I nailed it near the end. I was still learning when I started. But he's just like a ray of sunshine to me. 
is how I feel. Yeah, I think the texturing worked out well, too. Yeah, it's very smooth. It's nice. Very pleased. Gold, yellow, orange, fiery, metallic red. This I love this guy. This is in the stupidest spot. And most how? of the custom ones that we have, we have posted pictures of them on our socials. So if I'm not able to show them very well here, <laughs> just going down memory lane, there are actual nice pictures of them that are posted. I'm so proud of him. He's doing the whole. Yeah. All right, goodbye. He's very citrusy. He reminds me of the bee. Mm -hmm. A little bubble. Oh bubble no, his bubble. hand! Sorry, mister. How many of these has she broken oh, yeah, while oh, she's yeah. been playing the oh, way? Yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Been counting? Every single one that I've touched. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Strategic Shiro. Thank you for the follow. Thank you very much. Hello, hello. Welcome on in. Welcome to the sisterhood. Okay. D B F I U. Can these go down further? Yes, they can. Yes, they can. Yeah, just to keep him safe while he's are we traveling. Why are we packing? Ah, well, you see, three weeks ago, I received an eviction letter from my landlord. Love that. They plan to move into the unit, so nothing about me. I'm a great tenant, but they plan to move into the, the unit that I'm renting. So I have until middle slash end of May to leave this property. What is this? Did this fall off of the God Gundam? That's not part of my build, ma'am. Yeah. <laughs> Dropping little pieces in my workstation, <laughs> winning. <laughs> Leaving you little souvenirs. Was there a house update? I was just giving goose. one goose. Hello, hello. Hello, goose. So packing away. We're currently packing up all of the Gunpla Gundams. I've been packing stuff up because I know in May I have to leave. So it's just a matter of finding somewhere to go while we're while I'm packing everything up. So I thought it'd be fun to pack up the Gunpla Gundam on stream. It's just a fun way to go down memory lane and look at everything that we've kind of built over the years. Yeah. So, still taking a look, everything's been moving along, banks in a good place, waiting to lock in on something. Now Securing I have, the bag. Yeah, I have a good understanding of the market now, so I think we're, I think we're close. I think we're close. I'm, I've passed the point where I'm like trying to be conservative about the offers and the bids I'm putting at these houses now. I'm literally just saying, take all my fucking money, I just want to live somewhere. Yeah, fair. <laughs> So I'm doing my best. <laughs> yeah. Hello, just randomly pop in here. Well, welcome on in. I don't want to move either. I feel that. I like where I am. It's it's nice. Yeah. So I don't know what the new Gundam area is gonna look like. Once I have a better idea, we can show you guys. Mm -hmm. Depends how things go. Yeah. This is when you speak with Don. Corleone oh, yeah, to convince yeah. the landlord oh, yeah, to oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, thank Sky. you for the follow. Thank you. Come on in. Hello, welcome, hello. Welcome to the sisterhood. Hello, hello. Come on in, sis. Come on in. The... Yeah. I keep looking for F Runner and forgetting it's all these tiny little red ones here. <laughs> Every time. Why are we packing? We have to move. <laughs> like a little. I don't want to move. <laughs> we're, we're inching out of here. <laughs> I don't want to move. Well, little, too bad. You're moving with us. Everybody, we're all moving. Pack up. We're moving together. Yeah, we're all going together. Yeah. You can always come to Alberta. I'll house you. Thank you, Goose. <laughs> I don't know how well the cats would do in that like multi-day trip. Mm. The cats, Cotton is pretty okay in the car. Loki is not okay in the Loki, car. Loki, have a conniption. I'm gonna have to get him some like gavel or something to like. Yeah. Mellow him out a little bit. Yeah. That's a good call. Watch your profanity. Watch your profanity. Or Montreal, where it's a lot cheaper than most cities. Moving always sucks. Moving does suck. Go to the old We're all troll. living together. Or we're gonna have like a big streamer house gang. We're all yes. just gonna move in. You know the hype house? Picture that. What? Except Gundams. Worse. I liked, um, we had the idea once upon a time, and Will was always like, yes, let's do that. Yes. To like live right on the border so that the American homies can cr like hop the border yeah. and bring us that P Bandai. <laughs> Hydrate, thank you. Aloha, oh, hi Futaba. Thank you. What's going on, Futaba? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, well, let's just all move in together. Yeah. Um, but y'all have to come to Canada because Pina doesn't have a passport, so. <laughs> I do. It just expires soon. The states ain't gonna let her in. Y'all gotta come up here. <laughs> yeah, I'm a wanted man down there. Okay, and I just packed that. Which, you know, I need these fancy looking. I'm almost done the red. Some of these red pieces. Got the red Sonic shoes. Damn. These ones are pointy though. Like, look at that. Howdy, sixteen. Ah! Oh, Whoa. Geez, sorry, that was a loud one. Yellows. Hi, sixteen. Not much today. How are you? We're all right. We're a okay. Trucking along. Same MP. as always. Tiny, empty, empty, empty. Am I putting empties down here, or what's the deal? Um, those pieces what I'm gonna this? keep. Those are sword pieces. I'm gonna keep those, and I'm gonna keep the stickies. So I guess just throw them on the floor. I'll put them over here. D runner. D's nuts. D's yeah. runners. Gotta get uh, connections in Buffalo. True. Mokomo, I wonder how bad passport renewal is nowadays. One to two years ago, it was chaos. If you let it expire, it's way worse. Yeah. And you let yours expire, didn't you? No. It's just expiring. It's expiring So it's soon. easier to renew it if it hasn't expired. If it does mm. expire, it takes longer. When you renewed yours... Yes. When... How long was the... Your previous passport? Was it... What, like, how long was the year? Was it the 10, the 5, the whatever? I got the 10-year one. And I think it just makes more sense to get the 10-year one. Yeah. So I had the 10-year one. It was expiring within six months of when I renewed it, and it took about a month to do the whole process, and that's with a still active passport. Yeah. So if it's already expired, then it takes longer, because they need more information from you. Yeah. Whereas if it's still active, like, it's just, you submit all your stuff, and then you wait a couple of weeks for it to show up. Yeah. I have connections in Buffalo. What do you need? Hey! Mm -hmm. Hey, Will! P Bandai! Hello, friendos. Hello, P -Bandai. hello. Never get the five. Yeah, like, what's the point? Yeah, if you know you're gonna travel anyways. You can get five year ones? Yeah. I think ten year makes more sense, and I think it might also be a little bit cheaper, to be honest, mm -hmm. than buying like two five year ones. Yeah. I think. I need to renew my passport. It's been expired for a while. <laughs> Purple! Passport Canada should do away with the 10-year passports. You think so? I think they should just give us permanent passports. <laughs> Hear me out. <laughs> yeah. Just update the picture every once in a while. Oh, I meant five. Yeah, just do away with the five-year passport. Yeah, I agree. Okay. Oh, I didn't even trim these up yet. I'm still on the feetsies and you're yawning already? Did you finish your coffee? Nope. Still got a little bit left. I ordered an extra PB kit. I need to find a way to get to you. Will, oh my god. It's so expensive shipping up to Canada. It's ridiculous. Yeah. It's so rough. Very true. It's almost cheaper just to send yourself to Anime North and to bring it with you. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll see. You going to anime? Hey, Will? Will's going to anime. Will, who's going to anime? We'll be there. <laughs> oh, I still have two or three pieces that I need to just sand off the seam line because I had to touch it up a little bit. Mm-hmm. Uh, but then that's all done. Which then I just have to bring my pieces here to paint. paint. Yeah, you're ahead of me. I just finished building my kit last Monday's build night. Mm. I wish I could go. It's okay, bird soup. You'll be there spiritually. I am trying to figure it out. You're crazy, Will. I thought it was Will that was talking about it. Yeah, you're cray cray. I'm a regular at anime cons in Quebec. Never left the province. We had gone to Otaku-san last year. We did. We went to Otaku-san. Were we all there at the same time? And Maybe. I was scarred for life, so I don't know if I'm coming back. <laughs> yeah. Hotels are rough. That's fair. 
no guarantee I'll be going to uh, anime this year. All depends if GNTL has any spots available or not. Mm. Yeah, I think they've started the plan. We'll be there. We'll be there. Yeah. Oh, I'm very excited. You sound eepy. I just, I'm thinking. And thinking takes a lot of my energy. Taking a lot of... Takes a lot out of me. Just thinking. Basic thinking. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Hello friends, oh, yeah, Master oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Day! Hi, hey. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Andy, thank you for the follow. Andy Lethal, thank you very much. Come on in. It's good to see you. We put the Sonic shoes on the rest of the Sonic shoe. Oh yes, we were at Otakuthon. I'm part of the the Masquerade staff. We were uh, there. That was a lot of fun. So most of my Saturday is sacrifice, that's fair. Yeah, we did the, the fashion show. Oh, I was supposed to put... <laughs> I got ahead of myself. I always do that. Yeah, the fashion show, the masquerade. That was a lot of fun. Oh no, I need the part separator. And I'm gonna sneeze. Where is it? Oh. <coughs> tight. Oh, Hi you. from Mexico. Hi. Hello, hello. Hello, hello, Andy. Welcome on in. And you ran um, into me at Otakuthon. I remember Neon. And we ventured into the artist section. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to Fan service this. makes money after all. Yeah. I do remember. I remember. I have good memory. Oh. Elephant. My second movie of the day is starting now. I'll try to hop on again later. Have a great stream. Have fun. No problem. We'll see you later. Enjoy. Okay, so... Uh, hola! Como esta? I put this on when I wasn't supposed to, and now I can't get it off. Uh, assistance? And I am baby. <laughs> what piece? This white piece I want off of this red piece. Because I was supposed to attach it to the rest of the foot, uh, and I did not. I just... Oh, thank you! Kira, kira! Kira, kira! Lurker, thank you! Lurker, thank you. Kira, well, come kira. on in. It's very good to see you. I, yeah, I can't get it. I, I did a dummy. I took... Oh, yes, that's what I wanted. Yay! And then I attach it to the footsies. Do you want the And then the I have one? one more right here. So this goes like this. And then it goes on. Like this. Haha. -ha. To make it a little footy. Let's see. Good morning. Good morning, worker. 14. This big one. Sisters and some warm popcorn before I start the game again. <laughs> the popcorns. Nice. The popcorns. I had like three bags of popcorn mm -hmm. at the beginning of March mm -hmm. because I went to a Raptors game. Did you? That's fun. Yes. I went to a Raptors game. Raptors. Um, knew nothing of the sport. Have you ever seen that video where it's like, mm, go sports, go, sports. go, go team, go, yeah. you want some broccoli? <laughs> you want some broccoli? That was basically me at the Raptors game. That's fair. Um, but I won tickets, so I wasn't going to be like, you know what, I actually you don't want to won tickets? Go. Yeah. How did that happen? Through work. That's amazing. <laughs> and I didn't even enter. Okay. <laughs> My boss calls me. Love that. On like a Monday or a Tuesday. Maybe they just enter everybody. And I think that's what she did. She was like, so, hey, Smiley, I just want to let you know that um, I entered you into a draw. We were giving away Raptors tickets. I just entered everyone in the team. And I was like, yeah, sure, you have my permission. Like, no problem. Don't mind at all. Yeah. Know nothing of it, but I'm sure yeah. I'll find somebody to take if I win. Yeah. And then she's like, okay, great, because you actually did win. And I was won. like, oh, okay, thank you. That's so funny. Um, and she's like, so the game is also this coming weekend. Sorry, it's kind of like short notice. Yeah. And I was like, you know what? No problem. Make it work. Because um, our mother's birthday was that coming Wednesday. And I was like, I have no idea what oh, the fuck I'm going to get for her. So I took our mom for her birthday to the Raptors game. She would have loved that. I don't know if she knew a whole lot of what was going on either. No, no, but didn't. they put us up in the fan zone, so you're really up high, but there's like a bar and snackies and a bathroom right behind you, so you're very, Lucky. like, you get everything right there. Oh. 
Did you break it? No. Why would you assume that I Is would it break fixable? it? Is it Uh, maybe. Okay. Well, this part looks like it's not broken. Mm hmm So... Mm hmm So that is the part that is actually broken. And you have the plastic cement, don't you? And I have the plastic cement at my house. I have an extra plastic cement. Oh, oh I see. Oh. I see. Yes. Love that. For you. <laughs> oh! I'm, I've got the Midas touch. You know what? This touch. is fixable. <laughs> I have the Midas touch, but nothing turns to gold. I just break everything. It could have been worse, because I think with the way that this piece is fitted, it'll still sit, even though the pegs are gone. God bless. Can't even tell it's broken. Love that. Yeah. <laughs> um, just don't do any, like, acrobatics with this foot, and we should be okay. He's got the Achilles heel. Uh, Achilles toes. Achilles toes. <laughs> You didn't take peanuts? She's sports. I hate sports. That sounds like torture. Someone taking me to a game. Plus I'll go to a Blue Jays game. That's That sounds like my personal hell. I'd go to a Blue Jays game. I would rather do anything else. Do you want to tell them about, hey, guess what? I'm getting married. Smiley, my maid of honor. Planning my bachelorette with my cousin. Their ideas- Not there. Her, her, her ideas. I knew cousin, better. I knew better. She knew immediately. Um, she was like, "Hey, so what were the ideas? White water rafting, which sure that could be fun. Going on a hike. You're kidding." I was like, "I'm gonna stop you right there. Anything physical is out the door. She, not doing that. She is not gonna want to do it. If I'm not walking thing. from a car to um, a building or." You know, a short walk is fine on level ground. Going for a hike? I would rather die. In the summer, I would rather die. So thank goodness I got Smiley on my side. Who knows that I would rather die. She knows me very well. Yeah, I can't even get you to come out of the house for shit I want to do, let alone whitewater rafting or it hiking. It depends. It depends. I love a cute little a cute little day, but immediately after we did the mud run last year, you're like, hey, so would you want to do it again next year? No. I had another 5k later no. that same summer, do you and you were do like, the you know what, miss me no. with that. No, thank you. You I did your one it. moment of like physical activity, and you're like, I yes. did everything that I need to do. And I'm good for five years. Thank you so much. That was a great opportunity and experience. Never again. The only sport I enjoy is um, American ice football. It was on some German show, and it was absolutely hilarious. My entire body hurt from laughing. That I would watch. If it's comedy, I would watch that it. That sounds fun. Drinking wine and playing Stardew for The Bachelor? Heaven. My personal heaven. That sounds amazing. Best Bachelor party I've ever gone to. Was that a Renaissance fair? Sounds like heaven. Oh. That sounds hilarious. Get dressed up in Ren fair costumes. Go to the tavern, show some ankle. I would do that. Not up for skydiving. <sighs> I'm sure that also is physically demanding, but falling sounds better than hiking. You know what I mean? Just had lunch with my brothers yesterday. One is getting married. Said no strippers at, at The Bachelor. Um... That's fair. That's fair. Anime North bachelor party <laughs> is too on the nose. Hey, everybody going to anime. It's actually gonna, all of Anime North is my bachelorette. You could go to a fancy uh, gym for the party and watch all the muscle mom. Do you know what? That's actually not a bad idea. Muscle mommies and then go yeah. twink hunting downtown. <laughs> Can we all dress up in tactical gear and go twink hunting? That sounds <laughs> hunt. so fun. Wear ghillie suits. Anytime we see a twink, hunker down. We're gonna get arrested so fast. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds so fun! Let's go twink hunting. Let's go to the Ren Fair. Let's go twink hunting. 
Um, drink wine and play Stardew. This all sounds like a great time. I just went to the Renaissance Fair near me. It's so fun. I got so much when <laughs> they're going on. That sounds. My coworkers always talk about going to the Ren Fair. It's far. There's no one anywhere near us. I think there's one starting. It's uh, in the summer, and it's gonna be closer, closer by. Really? Yes. So if you want to come with my coworkers, we're going to the Ren Fair. Oh shit. Okay. Yeah. Showing ankle. At the tavern. It's gonna be good. Bro said, bro's fiance said male strippers are okay. Well, hey, you like what you like. First bachelor party I attended was out of town paintball. Still feel the pain after all these years and barbecue. Original plan was to go into a town and dress my cousin in woman's clothing. But he was saved by the storm that washed over. That sounds fun too. Hi Magus, welcome back. Hey Magus. See, paintball also sounds fun, but that sounds... a lot still. You know. I feel like two out of four people attending will be very good and the two people that are not good at it are gonna have a shite time. Mm -hmm. I have good aim and I would be maybe a little too reckless. I feel like you would pick one spot to hunker down in because you're not gonna want to do the cardio it takes to run the field. <laughs> I don't know, you'd be surprised. When it comes to that kind of stuff, I get a little too into it. Can't but see I'd Bella be, doing it. No, she would hate that. She would absolutely hate that. She would sit in the mud and frown. Yep, she'd be so sad. So sad. <sighs> Cause like our family is very competitive, so three of yeah. us are gonna be having a ball. I'd yeah, I'd be lone wolf. I'd go off on my own. Recipes. I'd I'd start twink hunting. And I get serious. Full mechanics aerial, yes. Yeah, it's great to be all bruised be, um, before a, uh, before wearing a fancy dress. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I guess it depends how how close how early that would be. Because mm -hmm. I get bruised at work all the time, so I'm going to take like a week off before and be very careful that I don't get bruised or scratched or bitten. That would suck. Not ideal. Definitely not. Pack a Gundam and hydrate. Hydrate. Oh. Sorry, doctor, I missed that pack of Gundam. Nine Gundam. minutes ago? Yeah, you, you be slacking, ma'am. You be slacking. You be slacking. I'll take this one. A little bat creature. Big your pente. The pente. Thank you, doctor. Packing this guy away. The big ear pente. Look at his goofy ass head. I love it. I do like the, the, the metallic green that shows through. I like the big ear bow, the big ear pente, and the Michaelis. I think yeah. they're all very nice suits. Adds character. Sure does. Um, I actually was planning on getting a tattoo. And I had to message them and to be like, actually, I'm getting cold feet because it was going to go on this ankle, mm -hmm. right where the slit in my dress is. And I'm like, if there's photos and I see a Kermit in all of my wedding photos, I'm going to hate myself. Kermit the frog. <laughs> Kermit the frog. So as much as I would love a Kermit, maybe not on my ankle or somewhere else, because if I see a green blob in all of the pictures, I'll be so upset. You can wait till after the wedding. Yes, I think I will. Um, so because I had the appointment booked and I put a deposit, I'm getting something else in a different spot. Um, so it's not that big of a deal, but I did have to message them back and be like, hey, so I'm really sorry. I think all of these are big. Uh, 
are you? Okay. I don't know if that kit has spare parts. I don't think I've seen any, but I'm going to take a quick peek. Oh, is this it? No, this is uh, Batman. Correct? This is Batman? The one up there? That's the Matsumina. Batman. Oh, I can see what you mean. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> this is Batman. Batman. Sup. What's up? Key. This Kiefer? Go this way. It wants it to go. Did I cut the what wrong one? What about hacking the I did cut the wrong stream. one. Scoback, that's a wonderful question. He's actually going to be the 65th uh, kit that I pack away. So hopefully we get to him, but also hopefully we don't. And that is the only time I will show you the Axio. You have all been warned. What is this? Nightingale. Batman. Where are you? You're the uh, flower girl, I think. Hello Kitty. That's the strike. What are you? Big gun. Yeah, some of these don't have names, but I know that's not him. This is Ecopla. You don't have a bag. I can put you in this. Spare. These are um, spare weapons. These are not, these don't go with a kit. Oh. These were okay. a standalone kit. Okay. God, that, I'm really searching my memory for some of these. I'll just put this guy in with these. With the spare parts. I'm kicking stuff onto the floor spare again. Spare stand. Goodbye. Is this an MG? Full mechanics I don't think is an MG. I think it's kind of like a mix between an HG and an RG. I think so. That's how I've heard people describe it. Because it's a big scale, and it does kind of have an inner frame. Well, not super inner framey. Ah. Got those packed. 12. Twelve. And Let's go. I just got another one. One frames go back. I'm updating now, so I keep trying. Yeah, Mark if you can please. get the, the Muse, I can relocate the Axia so I can take that shelf down. I can, what? Oh, I'll have to get a bag for them. Yeah, you're gonna need a couple sandwich baggies, I think. I'll go grab a couple. I'll be right back. Because I think that Lego one's gonna fall apart and it's gonna be the bane of my Probably. existence. Probably. <laughs> it's gonna drive me absolutely nuts. Eva 01 is impossible to get here in Germany for a normal price. That's Eva 01? I've seen... I've seen pictures of the Eva kits, but I don't know how frequently I see them in stores. You know what I mean? I don't think I've seen them. Oh, anything. I think I just saw a restock email, though. I've seen merch for them. Somebody just restocked the Eva kits. I completed Theo. He what turned out it? pretty good. Very thick. Theo. The o. figure so bad. They're really nice. I have the RG. Fantastic. Here in Mexico, actually. I've never see seen one. one. Full Mechanics is 1 over 100, but better than a no grade, this. I see. So RG probably. Time to grab my controller again. Thank you for streaming. Love ya. Love you, Mav. Oh, I'm dropping pieces again. Okay, I'll be back. Nobody missed me too much. <laughs> yes, ma'am. I dropped a piece. Hold on, I gotta... I'm keeping all the runners on my lap because I don't super have a spot to put them. Lately, are you two a couple? We're actually sisters. I'm the older sister. I'm three years older than Peanut. Peanut's my younger sister. Um, I recently found a bunch of photos of us when we were a kid because I've been packing all of my stuff away. So I have photos of Peanut when she was like, li like a baby Peanut, a little nut, the smallest nut. Um, we used to look a lot more similar when we were younger because she also had bangs and long hair, but she's cut it short now. I think the last three or four years she's had shorter hair. What? And my hairstyle hasn't changed since I was like 14 years old, 16 years old maybe. Y'all talking? Ah. <laughs> Kiefer asked if we were a couple, but we're sisters. <gasps> Where? Your hair looks very different. Her, she looks very much like our dad. Are Why are you blonde and her brunette? Because our mother growing up was blonde and our father is a brunette. So genetically, that's how it turned out. We're we also have similar colored eyes. We're a couple of sisters. <laughs> Oshinoko. Couple 
uh, homies. We are blood related. We do have the last name. The same last yeah. name. Well, I guess, like, if you were married, you'd have we the same last blood. name. We're blood sisters. We. <laughs> what? That's a weird way to say you're your sisters. We're blood sisters. We're blood sisters. Like, we, like, cut our hands and, like, <laughs> had a pact. Yeah. Blood pact. Yep. I do look like a lesbian sometimes, though, which is fair. Especially, where's the hat? Give me the hat. I don't. Oh, you put it behind you. It's back there. Too far away. Yeah. I'm gonna have to go down to the basement at some point. You do look alike here. Come. Our. F well, I guess we're farther away. Here, go to. Some people see it, some people don't. Some people see it, some people don't. So if I. If I swoop it. If I swoop it. If you get your hair out of your face, put your, put your hair back. This way. If I swoop it this way. If I swoop. Just get it out of your. <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm pulling my hair back! We have the same eye color. We both have like very round, round face. chubby faces. And we both have chubby cheeks. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So there's a three year difference. A Do lot of people think it? that Peanut's the older sister, but I'm older by three years. I know. Big time in the eyes, you can see it. The eyes are obvious. I can see the eyes are same. Thank you, Angel. Now we can't unsee it. <laughs> I see it a little. Some people do, some people don't see it. But our- <laughs> both look like dorks! <laughs> little check mark. But we have very different, like, clothing styles. I like a more feminine pink Light, airy, aesthetic. Pastel. Pink hair- or pink hair. Well, no, blonde hair. Whereas you like the more, like, earthy tones when you're dressing. Yes. Yes, like, I mean, look at us. I am wearing- Yeah, here, look at what we're wearing. I'm wearing cargo pants. Look at like, us. we have different styles in the way that we dress as well. Yeah, we're pretty much opposites in <laughs> physical appearance as much as possible, but our personality, mannerisms, and a lot of the things we like are the exact same. You have the same forehead. It's all in the forehead. That's true. <laughs> I like baggy clothes. I like to be comfortable. I like darker colors. I like fitted clothes, lighter yeah. colors. We have- some people don't see it, some people call us twins. Some people don't see us and see it and some people think we're like the same person. So is Peanut a lesbian? Hey, that's the light- that's the question. The lifelong question. It's one of the uh, seven mysteries of the world, actually. Both Are gremlins? <laughs> you might be onto something. What did I pick to pack away? Uh, the, you were gonna get the muse from the shelf. Yes. And the Mews we bundled, so you're getting you're yes. getting more than one Mew at a time here. Uh-oh. Exia doesn't have any friends now. <laughs> Sucks to suck, Exia. Uh-oh. Too bad, so sad. Oh, okay. Look at this Mew. A Pokepla. Smiley's fave Pokemon. Of course. Pink, pastel. Pink and adorable? Like, what is there not to love about this? Very kawaii. Sagoi Disney. Whoa. That's my girl. There she is. Going away. I also really loved Mewtwo as well, but if I had to pick, then I'm going with the yeah. Mew. A little blocks. A nano blocks. A nano Mew. block Mew. Boink. Boink. And then this little thing. I think he sits on a cloud. You got us a yeah. little cloud. Yeah. Has a little, has a little foie foie cloud. Yeah. It just rests its tummy on. Goodbye. Oh, did you count the ones on my desk? Nope. The Hello Kitty and the Bulbasaur. So there's actually 67, not 65. I can yeah. update. I just took mine. Thank you, Neon. Emotional damage! <laughs> Emotional damage! So that is 13 out of 67. 67. Uh oh, numbers going up. <laughs> Bye, Hexia. Bye, Bye Hexia. Away. And I don't know if you counted the strike in the closet. 
I don't think you counted the strike, the Caliburn, and the Schwarzette, which is another three. So now we're at 70. You were off by five whole things. <laughs> I said I couldn't count. Do you want me to count your copies? What? Hmm. Oh, you didn't count Farsia, so I'd leave it at 70. Because Farsia is, like, disassembled I... into a box somewhere. Oh, I did count her. You counted her because of her stance? Yes. Okay. Leave okay. it at 70 or... 69. 69! <laughs> Thank goodness. And Doctor has redeemed another one. Let me see those nices in the chat. And another. Oh my gosh. Another one. Let's do the Sand True and Sand Slash are my favorites. I love Sand Slash. Me I had too. a little like keychain way back in the day. I remember that. I love those. <sighs> Peanut makes animals feel better. She doesn't have time to maths. <laughs> I like to think so. Man, all these guys talking about the new Gundam series, the latest I've gotten is Thunderbolt. Is Thunderbolt? I love Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt was so good. Thunderbolt was very jazzy. Um, I'm watching all of the shows, Nanda, in a very strange order, because mm -hmm. I've watched Seed, Seed Destiny, Witch from Mercury, Thunderbolt, Stargazer, I don't think this and be. now I'm going back and watching the original series, so I'm only about halfway through, just over halfway through the original series. Mm -hmm. So there's like a big gap in my Gundam knowledge. Still waiting for them to finish Thunderbolt anime. I would love that. Thunderbolt was so good. Thunderbolt slaps. What is the blue thingy? This? This blue this, thingy? This blue thingy? It's a part separator. Yeah, this is a part separator. Peanut used it to break apart, so don't be confused with a part breaker. It's a part separator. It's meant to, uh... It is a part. Hi! Whoa. Hey, Edie. Do you want to give her treatsies for being a good girl? Whoa. Whoa, what is that? Little lady came for a visit. She will do anything for Treaty. She is so treat motivated. She likes to eat it flat. She has trouble taking it out yeah. of fingers. Um, she kind of struggles with that. Hi! Come here. You want some more? You gotta come. Oh. She's yelling for the food. She's like, you must feed me. Please. Please, man. Okay. You gotta watch your, your, watch your tootsies. Come this way. Oh, she's yelling. She's like, you will give me the snacks. Please, ma'am. Come here, lady. Oh, I need the lady. I need the lady. Oh. You didn't even chew that. I'm gonna give you little ones. Good girl! Good job. It's okay. We got you. I'm gonna just break these up in the bunch of little pieces so you think you're getting a lot but you're really not uh, oh 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 she's purring oh that's a good girl. good lady oh oh i'm sorry do you want another one lady wow whoa what's this she is purring Oh, that was a wet one. <laughs> wow! What a beautiful Good job! Girl. What a beautiful, beautiful girl. I think I heard another cat coming here. Yeah, it's cotton. Oh. Lady, wow! Lady's still getting used to. Oh, you can see cotton in the background. Don't fall. So brave compared to before. She's gotten so many treats today, Kid Bazooka. Like, she's been. Watch, watch, Cotton. I see you, Mr. Because we're gonna get a hiss if he comes hey. too close. Leave she's her. just staring at the treat bag. Yeah, look at her. Oh my Cotton, god. Cotton, no, oh please. Cotton, I need you to be good. Cotton. No. Back. Oh, cute calico. She's a sweetie. Do you want to go down? I think she might want down. Oh, you can go down. I'll lift you down, you little lady girl. Whoa. 
Good job. Wow. Those were some big purrs. Cotton being the creepy old man still? Yeah. Yeah. Only a little. Oh, you're still singing? Oh, that's a good girl. Hi. She's, she's settling in. She's doing a lot better. Cotton, you want a snacky for being a good boy? He I'll can't figure out how to get to you, but he desperately you. wants the snacky. There you go. Uh, that's a good girl. Okay. Wow. Yeah, you see him up there. Oh, she's watching him eat treats, and she's like, how fucking dare you? <laughs> Why does he get the snackies? You had so many. Be good. I'm watching you. You have a Tordy and a black cat? I have three cats total. I've got- do you wanna- can you grab him? Cotton is the oldest. Cotton's three years old. He's a big fluffy tabby. Um, then there's Loki. Loki is two years old. He's a big fluffy black cat. And the calico that you just saw, or would you call her a Tordy? She, she's she, calico. Calico? She's the newest addition to the family. She's six years old. This is big boy. Big man. This is Cotton. Big boss man. Oh. He wants it so bad to chase her. You want to go chase the lady? She's the oldest in the family, and she's the newest to the family, and a Cotton will not leave her alone. He needs to, like, see where she is at all times. Hi, Poggy. Hello. Hi. Hello. Did you get a snacky? Did you get a treat for your, for your good behavior? Okay, here we go. Good boy. So, Smiley, feeling any pressure following this move to find a perma partner? In this economy? A perma partner. In this economy? In this economy? God, everything is so expensive. Okay, you can go. Everything is so expensive. Don't harass He's a man her. of culture. He he is a man of culture. Um, his culture mean... doesn't uh, respect boundaries. <laughs> Cotton. Yeah, he likes the older ladies. Yeah, my brother's black lab dog is named Loki too. Uh, both Cotton and Loki are rescues, so they had whatever their names were when I adopted them is the names that I kept. So someone saw how much of a gremlin he was and decided to name him Loki, and it fit really well. Where do I? I need a two. It was nice that we had a visit from the little lady. Oh, that's so sweet. The little girl. Crabman's gawk going in. A2, Head first. Two. This one was clear, please. He's a big man. I'm gonna have to break him apart. Oh, jeez. I'm putting him in the spare weapons. Can you just compact yourself? Can, <laughs> can he act all like shy? <laughs> He's gonna be shy now. He's just a shy guy. Shy Misty. Our first RG that we ever built being put away. Yep, he is. He's the first RG. That one was from Hot Collectibles. Our first ever sponsored gift. Yeah. Damn, what a throwback. I know. Ask a question. Done. Cat tree both. We just gave them snackies. Good. These clear fleeces don't uh, sand super easily. Bit of a pain. Don't sand super well. This gawk is a really cool RG. He is really cool. I like him a lot. I think it was a great first one to build. It was a lot yes. of fun. It was really fun. The inner frame is a little cursed, but it's still really cool. Okay, so this is number one. Put this guy on first. Like so. Okay. Oh, he's not. He needs to be up a little bit more, I think. There we go. Okay. Uh, step two is this guy. Pack another. And keep those in right here. here. And lastly, this guy goes on top. Mm 
Oh, she hanging out right outside. Hi, yeah, lady. Is she in the corner? She like tucks around the stairs. It's like her safe space. Oh, sugar bear. Yeah. Is that from the Barbatos? Or did sugar give us more? From the Barbatos. Because the bear Batos used to sit up there. Yes. Oh, that's right. Oh, she's back. Hi. Hi, lady. You got a lot of snack on. She knows that this is the treat zone now. This is what we've done. Yeah. We're but I'm excited that she's exploring. Yeah, I'm gonna let her. Because when we, when we first started streaming, once little Cora Kitty moved into the house, she didn't come into the stream room. I think because it was loud and she was kind of nervous. Yep. Yeah. So she avoided it entirely. We've seen her wander in, I think, once or twice before. But she would wander in and then wander out. Oh. She's begging. Oh, careful. Don't, don't spin your chair. Hi. Hello, schmuckums. Oh, my God. Are you looking for snackies? You have so many snackies in your belly. She's gonna, she's gonna throw up. She's got yeah, so many snackies. I don't want you to throw up. So I'm gonna let you explore. Conditioned. Yeah, now she has been. Because Loki and Cotton come in all the time. Hi. What's she doing? She was just standing on her two feet like this, like a little T-Rex. You gotta come up onto the table. Do you know how to get up? Can you do the little jumpy? Does she need me to move the cat tree by the table? I typically keep the cat tree by the table so that she can use it as like a jump up point. At what point is a cat a senior citizen? How old is she? Six. She's, she's now- Is seven the cutoff? Six or this? seven. For the good, good. What's all this stuff? Yeah. Wow, she's like exploring the desk while we're. She doesn't even do this to me when I'm working. I think all of like the copious amounts of treats definitely did it. Yeah. This is a safe space, honey. Hi. This is a safe space. She almost ate shit there. Take your time. Just explore. Have a good time, sweet little little baby. Yeah, she's being so good. Look wow. That's very impressive. We encourage this, honey. Good job. Good job, little girl. She's here permanently now, so those of you who have been keeping up on the, the Cora updates know that she was getting used to this house while still living at her old home so she'd come for first it was a week-long visit then it was a two week long visit and now she's here for good and she, every time she came to visit it still there was still a period where she was kind of nervous and didn't want to come out a whole lot oh you're back that was fast but now she's here permanently so i definitely encourage her getting used to the home she loves the window yeah good girl look at you oh my goodness I don't think this has bag. No, it's an entry grade, so there's no extra parts. This is not a snack bag. Oh, she hears all the Ziploc yeah. baggies. Nice cat feeding and per ASMR. Three cats, wow. Cats get all the attention. Typical. Yes, especially this girl who's been so shy. She gets all of the attention. This guy's got long ass legs. I don't like the iron blooded orphans that much. That's fair. If I can get. If I can be lured by treats, does that make me a cat? It makes you cat adjacent. For sure. Entry grade packed away. Thank you, Scoback. Hi, little 
Being so brave. Being so lovely. Yeah. She's doing good. Good girl. That's a good girl. What a sweet pea. Gonna put the little cicada boy down there. It's nice that the other cats aren't here so she can feel a little bit more secure. Yeah. And the wing was the best, in my opinion. Well, doctor redeemed another one. They're keeping you on track today. Ooh, my dad's cat must be at least 10. Now that's a senior. Maybe she needs a box. I don't know if she would stay in a box. Maybe? You can see if she wants this one. This? Why is this one? Oh, what's this? You're definitely a little enough to fit in it. So it is here if you want it. You can stuff it. Are the other boxes in the way a little bit? This is all three minutes as we're stuffed. That's full of packed away stuff. There you go. Yeah, now it looks a little bit more inviting. <laughs> now she's like, oh my gosh, what on earth you want? Did you guys build any Verka kits? We bit we built the One, Wing right? Zero. The Wing Zero Verka. Verka. I think that's the only Verka that I've built. It's the MG Wing Zero Verka. My first MG kit. Little baby. This was our first SD? Or no? Was this one our first SD? Mm. The new, the high new, which I don't know where his back piece went. Gone forever. His back piece is somewhere. It might be because he was one of our first like ten builds. He might be in here. Perfect Gundam SD. Yeah, it's in there. SD new. So, do we want to just let him free float in there, or? I think he there? could free float because I feel like I would be able to know if something came from him because it'll be sd portions yeah portions oh my god size portion <laughs> treat him like a little wrong. snack yeah oh by the way have you ladies been to japan if you have been do you have any recommendations i have been to japan in 2018 i think that there is so much to do in japan People will typically cater what they want to do around... Mm, different people want to do different th things. So when my friends went, they wanted to do like the Muscle Mommy Cafe. They thought that was really fun and interesting. Some of them wanted to go to towns that were modeled around different anime series. Um, I wanted to go see a lot of like... Japanese style castles and Japanese gardens. So I did a lot of those sorts of things. I spent a lot of my time. I was there for three weeks. I did Tokyo in the Tokyo area. I did Kyoto and I did Osaka. Um, I think one of my favorite things I did was Nara Park, the deer park. That was really cute. The bowing deer. I had a really fun time doing that in particular. Um, it was also just a wholesome experience for me because a local came up to me, like an elderly gentleman, and he taught me how to properly get the deer to bow, and I was like, bless you, old man, for going out of your way, teaching me, some foreign girl, how to do the, this deer experience properly. And he was able to communicate with me using, like, gestures, opposed to really speaking too much because of the language barrier, which I thought was really sweet. So that was a lot of fun. You doing, lady? Oh, you smell the treats. You smell the She's treats. She's hunting the treatsies. I can give you one, but I'm not gonna give you a bunch. Hey, do you want one? I can give you one. Just playing you like a fiddle. Yeah, well, I'm easy. This way? Go. Oh. I can't give you too many. I don't 
want you to have an upset tummy. Yeah, well, well. She's telling you how it is. What do you want from me? More snacks. <laughs> Those are so crispies. I'll let you sniff. We also gotta hydrate. Were you purring? No, this is coffee. You don't want this. You wanna sniff with the... Oh, what's that? You wanna sniff the, the lid? Oh, she's so focused on finding where the Tracy's were. Oh, big sniffins. Oh, she likes that one way better. Oh, oh, he, oh. Okay. She licked that one. Did you see the life-size gunman in Yokohama? I, I don't think it was there at the time that I went in 2018. But I went to the Tokyo Gundam base and I saw the Unicorn Gundam. I also had the opportunity to go to the Gundam Cafe in Akihabara before it closed down. I got like a Gundam latte with like Gundam art on the top of it. And I got like Gundam meat buns that had like a pressed Gundam Cute. decal on top of it. Wow, she's just hanging out for the treats. Yeah. Oh, step on the keyboard. They're not there. I know, it smells so yummy. It smells so tasty. So tasty for the lady. Oh, thank you, Skullback. Sorry, I was distracted by the lady. Thank you for posting the Discord link. What up, peeps? What up, Cody? What up, Cody? You got a little meow meow here? A little brave meow meow? Yeah, she's she doing go. some good exploring. Yeah. Where? There was a Gundam cafe? There was a Gundam cafe. It closed down a couple of years back, but it had a bunch of like Gundam themed, I would say like cafe and small eat style. Waku waku, waku waku, waku waku, waku waku, <laughs> robot wizard, thank you. Waku waku, thank you robot. And they also had a lot of like memorabilia and stuff that you could buy as like souvenirs, that kind of stuff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That does sound really fun. So I'm glad I got to see it before it shut down. Edible gunpla when? I need gunpla is edible if you try hard enough. But please don't. We cannot condone that. Okay, and then this goes in this I spend one. so much time in Japan, I don't have enough paid time off. Yeah. Good day, everyone. Hello. Hope everyone is doing well. Thanks, Robot Wizard. Okay, this goes like this. Are you guys Japanese? Nope. No, we're European. We our mother's side is German, our father's side is English. So we are very European. And we live in Canada. Born and raised in Canada. Oh robot, thank you. That's very sweet gifting that sub to sixteen. That's very, very sweet. Oh, that was kinda of interesting how that got um, We do have what is called hooded eyelids. So, growing up, we've always been asked that question. Yeah. Always. Hey, fiasco. Yep, party that's time. very common. Yeah. Gundams have we packed? 16 whole Gundams. Damn. All caught up? All caught up. 16. I was, I'm very, I'm pleasantly surprised with how many we've been able to do today. Mm -hmm. Your eyelids are from the hood? <laughs> yes, they are. <laughs> they are from the hood. Yeah, I always got asked if I was Asian growing up because of the hooded eyes. Mm -hmm. Pale skin, hooded eyes. Ah, also, good time zone, sisters. Hello, Arcana. Good time zone. It's Hello. Good to see you. <sighs> hello, hello. Was up all night working, but can't complain too much. Fair enough, robot. Did you get a good sleep? Ah, Keyford, I am German too. We, um, our mom's side is, but we never really... We were never taught much about it growing up, and by the time we were old enough to appreciate it, a lot of the traditions had washed away, which was kind of sad. Yes. So we were never really brought up with much culture. Some of our cousins were brought up more German than we were, because our 
grandmother had three daughters and they participated in the German club. They got married at the German club. Um, our mother never enrolled us in any of the German club activities and yeah. she didn't get married at the German club like her no. sisters did. And they would, they were part of like the dance team and everything. So they would do that at, during like holidays or whatever. Um, yeah, we didn't do any of that. But I wish we had. Not that we would have known to ask for it back when we were younger. Mm -hmm. I'm more interested in the food. Which we food ate, is so good. Which we ate more of the food growing up. Yeah, I'm at the age now that I'll take our grandparents down to the German club when they're hosting yeah. events and we'll, yeah. we'll eat the food, we'll watch the shows, we'll participate in the events. Yeah. And that's been a lot of fun. <sighs> Body sore from the Lego convention. What? Beating people up at the Lego convention? Damn! <laughs> oh my god, that's crazy. That's crazy. Burning the midnight robot oil. Been there a few times. Gotta make the money. Mm -hmm. Smiley, I finished up the latest kit from... In era, in era, in era, where? Art box. In era plus, I'll let you know about it a bit ago. Hmm. You let me know about it. Okay, okay. I'll have to look at uh, that Is convention he... aerobics. Yeah, <laughs> hope you had a good time. Posted potato photo and play mo. Okay, we'll take a look. How were you raised in Canada? Do you eat fries with mayonnaise? Um, we eat Our fries with um, cheese curds and gravy is how we eat our, our french fries. Poutine. We were raised, I don't know, pretty, pretty uh, milk toast. Pretty milk toast. Yeah. It isn't until we get older where now we can seek it out ourselves where we're able to experience different cultures. My legs have been yelling at me. Ooh. I have gone to Germany. Our grandmother's from Munich, Germany. So I went when I was in university with Oma and Opa to visit and spent... That was me, lady. I'm sorry. Oh, did I spook you? Hi. Spent two weeks there, which was a lot of fun. Kira, kira. Um, Oma's been here for so long that she's not fluent like she used to be. Kira, kira. Kira, kira. Thank you, Zero. Thank you. Welcome on in. Hey there, Gunplay. Is this the new place? Nope, not yet. This is still the old place. Uh, we are packing up to get ready for said new place. Waku 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 Thank you, Don. Thank hey. you for 12 months. Damn, you've been with us a for a full year. year. Long time no see. It is good to see you, Dante. Sometimes these notifications make me feel old. I'm like, damn, we've been doing this for a yeah. while, huh? Yeah. Oh, she's going crazy. She's tweaking. Oh my god, she's zooming. Are you having a good time, lady? She was zoomies. My mom was born in Dusseldorf. Oh, I love the name of Dusseldorf. There's a lot of goofy names that are very nice. LOL, milk toast? Yes, it is a term used for like, waka waka. I don't waka know, waka. plain. Milk toast is very just like white bread, no seasoning, no flavor. Very generic. Very generic, bland base. So it's a term used for like, if you're milk toast or, you know, it's exactly that. You put two and two together. Robot Wizard, thank you very much for those 10 gifted. That is what? Waku, very waku, nice. Waku, waku. Robot Wizard, a, thank you. There's a train happening. It's a robot train. Choo choo. Thank you, Robot. That's very sweet. Thank you. If anyone got a gifted sub, make sure to say thank you. That's very, very kind. You are all pseudo Canadian by watching the stream, so please yes. use your pleases and your thank yes. yous. We use our, our, uh, our manners. Let me see. Thank you so much. I've been Thank missing you. your stream, but I'm glad I finally caught this one. We haven't um, been streaming very much. It's been hit or miss. So but you miss, you huh? haven't been missing our streams. We've been missing our streams. It's yeah. not you guys. 
Yep, I'm hoping the whole situation will be over early April, because when you close on a house, there's like a 30 to 60, upwards to 90 days before you can like actually take possession of the house. What's your favorite hockey team? Toronto Maple Leafs. I'm ready um, for the hate. Bring it. Calgary Red Flames. Bring it on. In it to win it. YouTube audio should be fixed. Thank you, Garrett. Thank you, Garrett. Thank you, thank you. Should be fixed up now. Red Wings. Bird Soup selects the Red Wings. Don't forget to use your A's. <laughs> Flipping a couple A's here and there. Okay, which one am I looking for? This one goes on this side. Oops. This goes in here. This comes down and goes in here. I, I like um I don't remember what team they were they were playing, but Calgary was um in a game and damn there were some fights. There were lots of fights. And the goalie skated right up to the line and pointed at the other team's goalie, really? threw his gloves down and was like, Because everyone here. else was fighting, so they else. were like, all right, it's and time And the goalies never get involved, but he's like, I'm gonna... It's my time. So he skated up to the line, the halfway line, down the rink, threw his gloves and was like, come here. Did the other guy take up the challenge? Yes! Did it was he? amazing! Oh my god. I love Calgary. They're crazy. I feel like hockey is the only sport where you're not supposed to fight, but it's encouraged. Like, there are sports where you're- the whole thing is to fight. Like, yeah. boxing, my, Muay Thai. Yep. Kickboxing. But like, hockey, the whole point of the game is to put the puck in the net. But if people start fighting, they're like, fucking get him! <laughs> get him! Yeah. Oh. I'll support Toronto by default. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um so funny yeah it is never encouraged but it also is low-key they're starting to crack down on the younger teams because yes. of the concussion rate so they're yes. starting to get the the juniors the bantams the yeah the younger leagues to be careful with the amount of fighting that they're doing which is very fair understandable uh because a lot of these kids were going into bigger teams with injuries already and so I mean, it also the makes point? them less desirable when there comes what's, training yeah. season, right? Like, what's the point in that? I feel like you can get injured a lot in uh, football as well, but yes. they you still don't see them fighting. No, no, they these don't big do ass that. dudes that run into each other during yes. the game, but they don't like they throw might punches. like they might say something snarky, but you they have use their never, words. Never, yeah, use, like, use your words. <laughs> yeah. But that's the difference. Like, Canada for a long time was known for fighting, just in general. It like, is what it is. I mean, certain places are known for certain things. We were known for like, for like bar fights and roughhousing. Yeah, what else is there to do in Canada? Hack Not a, a whole lot. Hack a dart. Hack a dart and go for a rip. Go for a rip. Go to the bar later and that beat. evening. Get into a bar fight. It is our culture. That is now our culture. Our milk toast culture. <laughs> nah, let the boys fight. from Detroit is, uh, has to be the Red Wings. Ah, I see, I see. Growing up, dad was a Red, uh, Leafs fan, so I just adopted that by default. Yeah. I've only ever actually been to a Leafs game once, because it's so expensive. Mm-hmm. Oh, we've reached a freaking level three hype train. When did we do that? When did any of that happen? I don't know. It was all Robot Wizard. <laughs> Robot, you're crazy. <laughs> thank you, Robot. That was very- yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, gang. Thank you so much for contributing. My team, the Islanders, aren't making the playoffs. Chris Osgood from the Red Wings was my fave goalie. My nephew's team had five players suspended for fighting this year at 14 oh, years old? See, that's way too young. Like, why? Come on. Toronto has a hockey team? Toronto does. Yes. Toronto Maple Leafs. Are they gonna mandate neck guards now? I don't know. I mean, you're not even allowed to play tag at schools anymore. Hey, I like milk toast. It's delicious. C1, C11. Oh, fresh bread? Nothing beats fresh bread. Useless uh, fact for the day. Milk toast is actually a type of breakfast consisting of a piece of bread 
and a milk based sauce. Then there's the word milk toast, which timid, bland, feeble. Very interesting. Yes. Milk toast is. Yes. And then milk toast. Milk toes. Or milk toes. Yeah. So Which is something completely different. There's gotta be a market for that. Oh, absolutely. I moved to Michigan, USA when I was 16 and loved hockey, so Red Wings have been my team since I was 16. NHL games are expensive in Canada? Relatively. I think it depends on the team that you're gonna go see. Yep. That's for sure, and like whatever it's, city it's in. Yeah, it's based on supply and demand. Hockey is really big here, so if it's high demand, the price is gonna be up. Yeah. Everything is expensive in Canada, it seems. Pretty much. Our dollar is not as good as the American dollar, so anything that. <laughs> any price in America is worse here. Yeah. Milk toes? Well, maybe. I finally got some God Hand 120 nippers. I love them. It feels like you're cutting butter. They're so good. Big, big upgrade. Congrats, Dante. Big upgrade. Yeah, you can feel the difference. Boop. This one. How are we doing for time? We're just about three? Just about three hours in. Is that your tummy? Yeah, boy. Oh my gosh. That loose bun wasn't enough for you? No. Damn. I'm starting to feel it. Feeling it now, Mr. Congrats, Krebs. Congrats, Dante. Oh, that's very sweet. Is Gunpla expensive in Canada? I would say it kind of depends. But it's more overall, expensive than the states, but yes, I think that's relative to the currency. Yes. Just a boot? You can get Just HGs for between 20 and $30 for the most part. 30 minute missions range from 15 all the way up to 35 because some of them are very extravagant. Yeah. Um, Pokey Pla are usually the $15 range. SD is usually $15 to $20 range. Mm-hmm. Those are the ones that we buy the most, so I would be guessing for RG, MG, PG. Because we don't purchase those. Yeah. It's all relative. So compared to the states, yes, it is more expensive, but it's reasonable still for us. Some of it. Last Red Wing game I went to, I had four elder Canadian couple that uh, come to the Red Wing games every week, all the way from Canada, and they've been Red Wing fans since they were kids. That's cute. That is cute. Canadians love, love their hockey, and it's not even like our national sport. No, technically lacrosse is. Lacrosse is technically Canada's sport, because we invented it. We did not invent hockey, even though we like to pretend we did. MG Kit is more like $40 here. Damn. Where? By me, it's more like $60. Those aren't too bad relative to US retail pricing given currency conversion. Yeah. I feel like a lot of those prices were kind of low. Maybe. I would say, like, give or take. We found some, some decent prices locally. You gotta hunt. Different stores offer different values. Yeah. Working on Sengoku Astray MG at the Gunpla Build meetup I've been going to. I'm going again tonight! Gunpla Build sounds so fun. Though the US market at least is oversaturated, so a lot of the retailers are running regular... 10 to 20 sales off stuff. Yeah, it's it's a lot less common here. Um, so the prices, Oof. there's almost never sales that we've seen. There's like holiday sales, you know what I mean? Yeah, and that happens once, maybe twice a year. 
basketball was invented by Canadians? Basketball? Good for us. Never been, um, I've never understood basketball, but I've also never tried to I don't, I don't, understand it. I don't remember the rules. I was on the basketball team <laughs> way back when. Yeah. Like, if I was playing, I wouldn't pay attention to the lines on the ground. I would just try to get the ball in the net. Net? Hoop? Whatever. I feel bad for you Canadians. For the prices? Fair. for more Canadian <laughs> national holidays so you guys get more sales. <laughs> I feel like that we have a lot of holidays. Next one's Easter. We have a lot of like mini holidays too. Like family day. Who has family day? Just Canada. And not even all of Canada. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say not even all like, of Canada. Certain places have family day. But you don't really have sales for those types of things. It's all based on whatever the business wants to do. What was it? President's Day? You have sales on mattresses? That's weird. That's so interesting. How is how is that connected? Gotta get a good sleep on President's Day. I don't know. <laughs> I guess. Maybe there's lore we just don't understand. I love interesting lore. I think there are nine or ten stat holidays. But nobody does sales for them. A lot of these pieces are undergated, which is beautiful. Nobody has an Easter sale. Nobody really does like a Thanksgiving sale. I feel like stores that do sales like that are like seasonal style stores. Yeah, get the stock out. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. Our presidents sleep a lot, I guess. I miss the early 2000s when I used to buy an MG for 25 bucks. Sounds like a great deal. Is there a Prime Minister Day for Canada? Nope. Nope. But we celebrate a Queen Victoria Day. We do. We do have a. We have Victoria Day. <laughs> it's coming up. <laughs> it is coming up. It's in May. Or June? May. May. It's always the same month as my birthday. Because then June is Canada Day. Do you have a Toyota thon? Yes, we do. We do have a Toyota thon. That's fair, but it's not a holiday. But that is true. Leg. I'm gonna come back for the other leg because I want to build the waist. I don't like having the the legs float around. I like attaching it to the waist. Yeah. So I'm gonna do the waist and then come back for the other uh, leggy. Okay. That just makes the most sense to me. That is fair. I do like my stomach needs a snacky, so I'm gonna wash my hands and find a snacky. I'll okay. Bring, I'll bring something up for us to nibble on. Oakley doke. Do you get discounts on Gunpla? It depends. Um, they might have some type of sale at a con, like a convention, um, but not always. Um, sometimes there's con, like, exclusive deals. And especially because we don't get P Bandai here, like, we can't just order that online unless we were to go through, like, a third party. Um, sometimes they'll bring P Bandai up to a con in Canada, and that is really the only time you can get it. Um, is she gonna eat the cat food? She might be so hungry. Who knows? I can't say. We will find out. Uh, but around like the holidays, maybe they'll have a discount, but it wouldn't be much. Because again, it's, it's not really... There's not much of it. So the market isn't oversaturated, so they can, why would they lower the price when they know that they can sell it for the price that they have it at, you know? 
Which is fair, I totally get it. Hey Nike, what's going on? That sucks. It's not great, but again, the, the prices that we have found, like there's, there's a shop, a, a local shop that we like to go to, mom and pop shop. And it's not just Gundam stuff, it's they have model cars and trains and airplanes and all that. Um, their prices are fair, they're very fair compared to other places that we have gone, maybe closer to the big city. The big city. Oh my god, a fucking muffin, dude! Yeah! Cheers to that, thank you so much. <laughs> a little chocolate banana muffin. Mm -hmm. There's some stores give 10% off for members at local clubs. Yep. Warhammer? Yeah. They have Warhammer too. When you're hungry and you take a bite of something, I'm like, that's a fucking good muffin. On a normal day, it's a pretty mediocre muffin, but today I'm like, these. that's a good muffin. Yep. I like to support smaller business when I can in general. It's always a good idea. Mm. Smiling in the muffled nice. Mm. Sounds like a muffin. I've been going to thrift shops a lot. Um, buying housewares, little trinkets. I gotta say, it's nice. And that thrift store, all of the funds go towards the local hospital. So the prices are really, really, really cheap. And I know the money is going towards a good cause. So why wouldn't I do it? Shipping from Canada to the States sucks. Yeah, it does. That's why we don't really buy a whole lot online. Yeah, it's just expensive to pay for shipping. And then sometimes you get hit with customs fees, which is no fun. Yep. Additional taxes. Did you see the lady down there? Yes, I did. <laughs> she was underneath the couch, and when I came downstairs, I think I scared her. Because she ran up the stairs. Like, her safe spots are in the corner of mm -hmm. the... The upstairs yeah. um, by the railing there's like a little corner that she sits in that's a safe space and being on the stairs is a safe space so when mm -hmm. I spooked her she ran to the stairs mm -hmm. how do you guys eat muffins because there's two types of people I eat the top first and she's eating it from the side first <laughs> I'm kind of eating the top <laughs> I will eat the whole top before I remove the wrapping mm. to eat the rest of it I go top down I just, uh, go where the wind takes me. Oh yeah, 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 CX style. Welcome on in. We're having a little snack break. How are you doing? Welcome on in. Hope you're having a lovely, lovely day. Working on the waist for the full mechanic. Cody. Pack away. Aye, aye, Captain. I like muffin tops. I feel like that's a thing. Don't know what that means. Muffin top is like the little the little bit that sticks out over your pants. Mm -hmm. Oh, like a muffin. Okay, I understand. Get it, yeah. Um, mm -hmm. I see that you're cultured. But yes, I like I like taking a cupcake and if the icing is way too much, because you know when you bite into a cupcake and it's like all icing, you take the bottom and you sandwich it on top. I've seen people do that. You have chocolate on your lips. <laughs> Here you go. Still a little little bit of schmutz, so no, nope, other side. There you go. There you go. Okay. It's a day, but I've had my coffee, so it's good. No, you got a little bit of try again. Try, just touch it with your, touch it. Up top, up top, up top, up top. Got it. <laughs> Nailed it, first try. <laughs> There's witnesses. I do love me a coffee. Blueberry, it's chocolate, um, banana chocolate chip. Banana. Banana? Yeah. 
Um, as you guys know, I've had a- my diet's been exclusively McDonald's for the past three weeks. Okay, this is also So for breakfast, I just had the McGriddle buns. You know how the McGriddle sandwiches have, like, their- the breakfast sandwiches? You can get the McGriddle breakfast sandwiches? I got just the buns. Loose buns. And that's all oh! I ate today. Oh aside God. from this muffin. And it is now 2 p.m. I broke him. So I was like, I really just need something to eat. You two sisters are like yin and yang. We get that a lot. Yeah. Again, we are so... We're very we're, similar, but we're very different. We're so the same. But yeah. But that's what makes us a good team. Cody says you can also finish your food before you start packing. No! I must. Okay. Okay, this is one of... This was the second kit that we ever... Like, HG, that we had ever built. And I painted, painted, with some Gundam markers. Flip them over. Damn, look at this boy. This one is still messy. I am gonna mess with the focus. I'm pretty sure you can like just see the nubs on this. Yeah, you can. You can see all of my nub marks. You can see where I got messy with the paint. You could tell I had no idea how to sand. His V-fin is broken. Oh yeah, that dual assault has been through the ringer. He's got a yellow ass. I stand by my choice. <laughs> yup, there he is. This is the second HG that we ever did. It was on stream. Like two years ago. Two years ago. He scuffed as hell. But we love him dearly. But he's... yeah. You can see the progress we've made because of these guys. Hmm. I'm wondering if I can put, oh sorry, his weapon in here. Cause he's got a little dual assault spot. Yeah, he, he's one of the earliest ones so he has a little spot. If I can put his weapon here, I can just let him free float. Are you okay with that? Or do you want him in a bag? I could put him in a if bag he, with- If he free floats, I don't want too many HGs free floating because then I have I to guess them what together. parts they came from. I could just put them together in the same bag. That's true. So, he shall sit here beside me. Yeah. Muffet tops are also called love handles. Yes, yes. Me, 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 me. Thank you, Cody. Tasty. Add this one to the pact. 17 out of 69. Nice. Look at us complete. Yeah, the second one ever. Cray cray. Yeah, it'd be cool if we could get everything off of those shelves, because then I'll pack those shelves. Yeah. Or I'll just like relocate them onto shelves over here or something. The girls are expansive. I'm aiming for a McDee's tomorrow morning. Have to be downtown super early. Yikes. Hoping the new place is like, uh, there's a McDonald's in my house. <laughs> <laughs> Fair. I'm very new to building kits. Any tips? Do what you're comfortable with is my yeah. biggest tip. Take your time. I feel like there's so many tips, tricks, and tools when it comes to building, but start with what you're comfortable with. Yes. Get a feel for it first and then start to experiment. When yes. we started building, we were using the cheapest things that we could find, and we just wanted to learn how to use them before we started dropping like money on better tools, because it can get very expensive very quickly. Yeah. Just have fun with it. Take your time. There's no need to rush. There's no need to dive into higher grades right away. There's um, no expectation to do anything a certain way. It's entirely yeah. up to what you are comfortable with and don't let anyone tell you otherwise. There's no right way or wrong way to do things. Um, yeah, clearly we all start somewhere. <laughs> so if it is- And that's not even the worst one. We have one no, worse than this. <laughs> if it is not perfect on your first or second or even third, don't sweat it. Yeah. Do not sweat it. You'll get better as you go. Yep. Because then you can look back and be like, wow, look at that. Oh, look at this art. Would you look at that? 
Did you see the new one? What new one? I am caught up. My griddles are expensive. Mm. Are they expensive? They were like, it was like two dollars, two fifty. Maybe the full was... sandwich is expensive. I get just like the the loose the buns. buns, or I'll get the apple pies because it's two for two dollars, and I'm like, well, oh, yeah. why would I buy one for a dollar fifty when I can get two for two dollars? So I just buy two. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you airbrush? Um, yes, I have. I have airbrushed two kits, so I'm still relatively noob, but this one was the latest. The HG God, and I painted him hyper mode. I'm very proud of him. He's so smooth. Um, he's very bumblebee, very like citrus, very refreshing, um, and I'm very proud of him. I feel like I nailed how to do smooth airbrushing with him. It took a little while, but again, nothing nothing comes naturally the first time ever. It's never gonna be perfect the first try. No, so I took my time. I was kind of teaching myself as I went. Yep. And that's okay. Every attempt is a learning experience. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, so yes. That's orange as fuck? Yeah, he is. Also built the kits you want to. You can also look up reviews to see which kits are well rated. That's a good point, Dante. Yes, fine. Go to a store and be like, hey, I like this kit. I don't know what it's from, but I like it. Because I haven't seen hardly any anime. I've seen a couple Gundam animes, but that's it. Smiley's seen a lot more than I do. I prefer the hobby over a lot of the, the stuff, the shows. Because if there's a lot of talking, you lose me. I got a short attention span. A little brain. A little peanut-sized brain. Um, so you don't have to know everything about the kit either. Just go to a store and be like, hey, that's sick as hell. Pick that one up. Or watch a show, be like, that's my favorite kit from the show. Build that one. That'd be cool. How did you get the panel line in red? Oh, for him? Um, it's a marker. It's one of the Gundam markers. And a lot of the times, if I have a color in for a marker or a, a paint bottle and I want that specific, color for the panel line, I'll use a paintbrush. So I'll press the marker to loose some of the the paint in the marker into my plastic palette and I'll just go in with a fine uh, brush and do it by hand. Some I have panel line markers um, in colors that I'll are are fine and then I'll use those but if it's one of the chunky paint markers um, I go in with a brush okay I have tea now watching you guys make me want to build something but I have so much painting to get done that's okay no problem oh you don't have tea you have literal tea oh I see I see <laughs> I thought you meant you had the tea sis What is the biggest kit you have done? Nightingale. The Nightingale. Just because it's huge. Yeah. It's the, just the HG Nightingale, but it's so big. The HG Nightingale followed by the HG Kshatriya. The bananas. And then I think if from there it's a toss up between the MG Gun Tank and the MG Wing Zero Verka. The Gun Tank is like wide, but he doesn't take that vertical space. Yeah. So he seems smaller, the, but the he's chunky. The wing is skinny, but then the wings take yes. up space. Yes. Definitely. If you didn't have the wings... Yeah. The wings also on the biggest stand that we have yeah. to, like, hold him up. Yeah, he takes he's up a lot, a, of, thick boy. a lot of real estate. Okay, I have to pack away again, though. I think I grabbed the wrong piece here, so that's why I'm just kind of, like... Do you oil wash or dry brush? Yep. Um... I've dry brushed a bit. I am an art student, so I was very familiar with painting on canvas. So a lot of techniques 
I have used on campus, but when I first started trying to do it on a smaller scale, I struggled a lot. Um, but I've been able to get used to it. Um, I had, I don't know if it's still around, I think it's in my brush bag, but I have specific brushes that I've used for dry brushing that I have just destroyed. <laughs> that are like, all, they're all mangled and- Thinking as they're from like the dollar store. And gnarly, yeah, they're dollar store brushes, but they're all gnarly and awful. I could never imagine painting with them properly because they're so fucked up now but they get me that perfect texture I'm looking for. It's my go-to dry brush. And I have a couple oil washes um, that I've used a few times. I have like a red oil slick color, um, some rusty stuff. Okay, I have to pick one before I can get distracted. <laughs> oh, and look who, I'll do the, uh, the astray to go with the dual assault. Uh! Get your hand on, mister. Actually, I might take your sword out. Now this, this man was the very first HG. And God, he looks not the best. But he is loved. Everybody say love. Love. Okay. <laughs> now this man has seen some shit. It's our first HG ever. Oh! Okay, I'm gonna give you guys the full, <laughs> full experience. Can I get the you HG earphones? astray. His eyes, goofy. The stickers, smiley put on, goofy as hell. Uh, you can see the paint is bad. Look at that uneven, um, textured. Look at that, eh? Inner in the arms, on the head, on the chest, the side of the head, you can see where I got kind of wonky there. The arms, look, that's not even a, a proper circle. I couldn't even paint inside the lines. The back. I don't think we had like top coat yet. So a lot of the paint is like scratched off legs you can see there's a classic spot on the legs on his thighs where i was like doing black line here and it just fumbled and went uh, into the gray never fix it never fix it just left it yeah look at that that was our first ever attempt at this building and painting hg gundam on stream this was the very first one very first build very first paint and i love it and I love Two it. Two whole years ago. Two years ago when we first started. It's a relic. We've come a long way. Yeah. Damn, look at them loafers. You've always said estrays look like they're wearing yeah, loafers. Yeah, old man loafers. Yeah, look at this guy. This was the first kit I built in this century. Holy shit. Fourth total? Damn. Oh, fuck. My biggest was the Verka Shars Sazabi. Sazabi! Speaking of the struggle, show us the eggs yet. Purple, I said he would be number 69. So we have to, that way, we have to get all the way up to 69. He will be the very last one. Okay, these guys can go together. The brothers, the sisters, the HG Astray, and the HG Dual Assault, our first and second ever. Beautiful. What's wrong with loafers? Nothing, they're very fashion. Oh, there's another one, hold on, from Cody. I can't eat this without like touching it with my plastic fingers. Fair enough. Time to burn points, guys. That's kind of the idea we had. It's a pretty dope paint job though for first shot. It's 
Thank you. She did go to art school, so you would have a, like, I mean, at least some level of expectation that for she... For my standards, even when I finished doing it, I was like, this isn't a great job. Anyone could see that this is not a very good job. But it was still a lot of fun, and I've gotten very good at... If it isn't perfect, that's okay. You adopted that pretty early on. Very early. Because I'm like, we're going to see our progress, and I'm going to try to work hard each kit, and I'm going to try something new, and I'm going to get better. And looking back, like I can look at these guys, and then I can look at my god. My (laughs) My HG. (laughs) My god. My HG god versus the first two, and I'm like, I've made a lot of progress. And I can clearly see that. Can I get chocolate on my face this time? No, you're good. Okay, well, well, well. Another one? Yeah, well, I'm clearing off. Your first custom? Yeah, this was like the first proper full paint. <laughs> Look, it's just a normal Earth Federation suit. It's just a, a granddad we had. No, this is the HG Sharzaku. We uh, we had multiple paint ideas for this guy, but we let chat vote on like four, three or four different ideas. And um, one was painting him like a Koopa, like Bowser, because of his spiky shell. Um, he was very, very Mario, very Bowser. A lumberjack, because he has an axe, or it was Smiley's idea, painting him like an Earth-fed suit. Cause I don't like Xeon kits. <laughs> Cause she didn't like Xeon kits and still doesn't love them. Um, and that Get one it to won. Spite purple. Every time I see the kid, I almost didn't follow. <laughs> yes, very much to spite purple. <laughs> and this was like a full paint. And I feel like it turned out pretty damn well. It turned out pretty you- good. Had, that was your first custom in like your third paint ever. Third paint ever. Like I was using a brush, it's not airbrushed. It's brushed. So the unevenness you can see close up because I mean it's not like an airbrush quality. But it still turned out so well. I'm so very proud and it was such a goofy idea. It was fun. It was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. Um, he doesn't have a bag because he's here. He doesn't have a weapon. Do you think he would be okay free floating or no? What if someone scratches him though? Because he's painted so nicely? Then he'd be dead. He's not painted so nicely, but I really (laughs) appreciate that you would say that to me. That's very sweet. I can go get more bags. You're out already? Yeah, because a lot of the early ones are in the... Are in there. So I can go get some more. Damn, honey. Who Looks knew like an actual knew? kit. Thank you, Skomac. Wait, that was a Zaku? Yeah, it was. I'll leave him right here for now. You can chill. Hidden in plain sight, right beside the grand- granddaddy mouse pad. Can't even tell. Free float him into the trash can. Purple! Purple, no! Uh, I thought that was a special kit. I didn't know it was a custom. Yeah, Peanut just painted this herself. I think there's, um... There is an Earth Federation version of the Zaku, however, it's a full white kit, I believe. It's not painted like the Granddaddy, so I think you can buy this kit in a solid white. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you not clear coat all the custom paints? We do now, but this was her third paint ever, so I don't know if she, like, if we had top coat yet. Do you know if you top coated this guy, or was this before we even had top coat? To be honest, I don't know. I think it might have been before we even like when knew we, what top coat. When we started, was. we had nothing. We, we had, had we bought the primary colors, white and black. We didn't buy, we didn't buy a like the primer. We didn't have primer. No. And we didn't have top coat. We no. had five colors to our name, we and had, they're all on this kit. We had a nail file <laughs> for nubs. We had a $15 pair of nippers. We had dollar store paintbrushes. That is what we had. Yeah. Yeah, you're using dollar store paintbrushes for a long time. The first year. 
the entire first year you're using dollar store paintbrushes. And then I didn't start using nicer brushes until we were gifted some by Nine Steps. Nine Steps and came Plamod. in and was your savior and so was Plamod, yeah. That is when I started using nice brushes. I was using dollar store ones. Again! Can you show the Earth Federation Zaku again? Yes. Again, you don't- I still only have six colors, says Doctor. <laughs> when you get into the hobby, you don't need all of the things. We had very, very little. And we made it work. And we had fun with it. Because we didn't want to spend too much right away, right? We wanted no, to kind of ease it We didn't have any hobby. money. We still don't have any money. <laughs> you kidding? We didn't have money for stuff. We tied up this camera I already had from my dad. It was a graduation gift. I got this camera. We tied it up with string. We tied it up with string. And it fell over constantly. All the time. Our, it's always been scuffed. It's been scuffed since day one. And I mean, we have come a long way. <laughs> Considering we've come a long way. But it's so funny to think of that. Yeah, we've, we still have some of the original stuff, but we used to tie that up with string. It used to fall. We used to tie it up on that curtain rod. I'm finally throwing away the uh, ring light that it used to sit on. Yep. Uh, because we stripped the screw. Yeah, we did. So it's not usable anymore. It won't even stand. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna steal this guy. Pack him away. Pack you away, mister. Thank you, Cody. Yeah, look at this man's. A lot of these pieces are undergated, which is really nice. Ooh. It's a very nice quality kit, I think. Visually, anyways, I'm not building it. Well, you can kind of see the undergating on this one, actually. Ooh, so I will store. fix this. Mark is complete. 19 out of 69. We're schmoovin'. Yeah, we are. Clear coat it before you move. I guess I could do that. Do you think I should? Faster to airbrush it. Really airbrush cool. it with clear coat. It would be faster. In the gun, it's we have um, it's in the spare. It's in one of these. It's in the. He has a little slot in here. He still has everything that came with him. Yeah. We just wanted him to look like a polite little boy, so we didn't give him weapons. Smiley funding a house on gifted subs, for sure. I We only use any money that we make from Gunpla yeah. Sisters goes back into Gunpla Sisters, so we don't take any of it out for personal use. It goes back into tools, kits, paints, um, equipment upgrades for stream, but we've never tapped no. into it for personal use. Nope, never have. It's never important will. to us that it goes back into the hobby. Because we wouldn't be able to do all of this if we didn't use it for that specifically. Yes. Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you. B. I think that was the kit I saw on Instagram. Oh, I found you guys! Holy shit! Dang. Yeah, it's going back. Yeah, we posted a TikTok and then it was the nobody's gonna know. How would they know? And it was of our shelf, our Earth Federation shelf. And people were like, I had to watch that like three times to actually see what- To find them? To find what was up. And that made me so proud. My first two kits in 1999, I used cuticle clippers in a nail file. The nubs haunt me to this day. My friends use a nail clipper. Mm-hmm. I use $20 Amazon brushes and acrylic paints. $20? I use $7 Amazon brushes. Oh, damn. Yeah, we were we were dollar store homies for the first year. Mm -hmm. Does he still have the meal I went? Yes. Yeah, he sells all the stuff. Zaku was my fave kit. I really like them. Not all of them, I will say, but there are some Zaku oh, kits I that want I'm the, a fan of. The Blaze Zaku Phantom. Mm -hmm. I think it's Ray. Is his last name Ortega? Ray from Sea Destiny pilots it. 
and it's like a white zaku with purple accenting yes. and it's stunning yeah love the green beans. pastel anything and i'm in yeah you're pretty you're pretty easy to please i'm pretty easy the house will contain the gundam room though that's fair do you think we could write off um a house because it has a- you'd only be able to write off the amount of the house that takes up the Gundam room. Hey, that's still good. The entire house. We'll make it a Gundam house. Yes. We'll ask Playmod to send us one of those big statues. It'll be good. That would have to go in the front yard to, like, warn everybody that this is the Gundam house. That'd be sick. Wait, why is a house not equipment? Get a full-on studio built. <laughs> there we go. That's what we're talking about. When will we get a tutorial video from Peanut on Airbrushing 101? Um, when we have time and space to do that. When Peanut has any drive to do anything outside of her day-to-day -day for Alpha have Sisters. When I any sort of motivation, I'll get right on that. I worked my way up from $15 nippers to $60 nippers. I'm glad I did because I know how to use them better. There you go. That's the thing is it's I prefer starting with the lower end stuff while you're getting practice. used to it. Yeah. And then I feel like once you've used the lower end, you appreciate the higher end ones more because you've had experiences with some of the lower end ones. Yes, you gotta take care of your tools because then your tools will take care of you. So if you jump right into expensive ones and start abusing them a little bit, you they're not, not going better. to, they're not gonna last as long. Even once you upgrade nippers, I'd always recommend keeping a hold on the old ones because clear pieces are not very good for your nippers, especially if you get expensive ones. Mm -hmm. So I always use a lower grade, or not my, I won't use my god hands for clear pieces, even if it's second cut, because it's so crusty sounding. Ugh. It's like nails mm -hmm. on a chalkboard. Not good. Not good. I feel like that Gundam's pack number hasn't increased in a year. It definitely five minutes ago increased. But it slowed down. I 19, a, dang. I have a second to, uh, second to, to nibble. Where are you, Ortega? I think I know that guy. The blue boy. Are y'all moving to a house as roommates? I keep trying to get Peanut to move in with me, and I've been trying to get Peanut to move in with me for like three years, gang. Uh, it's just me. <laughs> it's just me, because it would be cheaper to have Peanut live with me, because then we could go split these on finances. But I don't think we'd be good roommates. We've I've... done that before. We were raised together. Yeah, I think it's different when you're younger, though. Yeah. When you're younger, siblings are a pain in the ass. When you're older, you're like, all right, this kid's all right. <laughs> You know what? You're all right. Jace Wolf. Hello, hello. Oh, pop that back in. Char was the man. We're going to get RX-72 painted like a Zaku one day? Purple's been asking for that for forever. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, waste done. This First time getting gone hand clippers after using regular hobby clippers was life changing. I'm still blown away. Yeah. Oh, doctor, I gotta pack away. There we go, and then we can attach it to the body. Question for you. Why do you dip your finger in water when sanding? Aha! Because I am paranoid about being safe while I build. And maybe, maybe it's safe anyways, but that's just who I am. So when you're sanding, you're knocking up a lot of plastic particles into the air. So some people like prefer to wear a mask so that they're not breathing in the particles. Some people don't sand a whole lot, so they're not worried about it. Um, I sand a decent amount and I sand more when I'm doing seam line removal, then I'll use sponges and I'll really fucking go to town. So by dicking, <laughs> By dipping my finger in water, I then will either tap the part that I'm gonna sand or I'll tap the top of the file to get the file wet so that when I sand, all of the plastic dust that I'm knocking off of the part stays in the water so that I'm not kicking it up into the air. So it's for my lungs so I'm not breathing in plastic particles and I also do it because cotton, the big fluffy tabby, has asthma so it's good for 
not getting it into his lungs. Oh, I'm sorry, you just walked back into a shit show. <laughs> Instead of dipping my finger, I said dicking. So you're gonna read dicking in the chat for the next, like, five Yo, minutes. Yo, <laughs> that's so inappropriate, Smiley. Why would you do that? It was an accident. Dude, it was an she's accident. fucking wild. Purple says I licked the particles off my fingers. I'm 14% gumbo at this point. <coughs> yeah. Rx78 black tri-stars, that would be cool. Okay. Have you asked Uncle Walnut to be your roommate? He might be a bit of a pain in the ass to have a roommate. I don't know about that. That sounds chaotic. Yeah. Don't worry, the science people already told us we are full of plastic bits. That is true. Microplastics. That is true. I notice it a lot more when I'm... Uh, seam lining and I'm taking a plastic Freudian sponge slip. and like going to town. So right. But even like looking at my file I can see little bits of plastic on it so I just I do it to not inhale plastic. Look at this. This is your very first started at all. Started G sisters. And his uh, forearm is backwards. Yeah sure is. Mine's broken so <laughs> that's yours is better off than mine. Yeah, look at this I am guy. looking to become one with the plastic. An EG granddad. Our first boy. We built this at a convention together two years ago, right after COVID, the first con convention after COVID. Um, and it, we kind of stumbled into building him. Like we, I didn't know Gundam, never watched it. I knew it existed. Smiley had watched Gundam Seed, but that was it. A friend suggested we go check out this workshop. It was free. You get to take a little souvenir home. And we're like, hey, we love free stuff. Empty. We were like, you'll bet. I oh. love free things. Empty. So we went, we built. It was a lot of fun. We came, we saw, we conquered. And then we bought these two brothers. Two brothers. Yeah. Having only watched Seed, I picked Seed kits. It's yes. kits that I recognized. And then we got these like that day or the day after. And GS was born. She picked a red and a blue because it's kind of like close to our favorite colors. And they were kits that she knew. There you go. EG. He doesn't even have like his eye stickers. You just, best. you just skip those. Probably. I don't know if I even gave mine eye stickers. Mine's leg is fully broken. Busted. Threw a container of spaghetti on top of him. It'd be like that sometimes. You sometimes know? it happens, you know, in the wild. R.I.P. And there's also this guy. Oh, did I start building the wrong leg? There's also this little crabby man. Ah! What did you want to do with this crabby man? Um, put him- his legs fall off, so putting him in a bag is probably yes. a good idea. He falls off consistently. He's cute, but I prefer my little cicada crab boy. This guy. <laughs> Alright. And with that, we are now 20. Making good progress. Damn. Um, and now the only thing that's on the, those shelves is the Exia and a little blue thing. But I kind of tied him in with the other little blue things on that shelf. Mm -hmm. Tiny itty bitties. Yeah, we could do the, the three SDs over there next. Yeah. I love microplastics. Gang, please. <laughs> Y'all started so early, I forgot to start watching when I logged into work. It's alright. You're here now, and that is all that matters. So that file you're using is glass? Yeah, this is a glass file. This is a Razer glass file. This one's omnidirectional. I do have another glass file that's single direction. So I've got this display glass file. But this one has ridges going across horizontally like this, so I can only go up and down. Whereas this one's omnidirectional, so I can kind of sand in any direction that I'd like. Mm -hmm. But even when I use sponges, I'll use water to help it stick to the sponge. Oh, that doesn't go in there. You should see me when I sand for my eco plug gun tank at home. 
I have a damp towel that I rest everything on. Mm -hmm. And I'll like rub the whatever I'm using to sand onto it and then go in and then just keep doing that. And mm -hmm. having that wet cloth there makes it so much faster. I've noticed when you're doing um, sponge sanding after you've done like seam line removal and there's sand everywhere. When I wet sand, um, it dries and you can see all the microplastics like yeah. in the water stuck to the kit. So then I have to give it a bath after to yeah. like wash it all up. Yeah. It's really funny. I'm waiting to bathe my pieces um, until all of them were done. Yeah. <sighs> it's so cute watching it take a bath. <laughs> I love a little, it. A little bubble bath. Okay, I think this one's empty too. Check. Yeah, empty. Thank you. Pack accomplished. Go back. Thank you. Hold on. Did you do you read the Gundam Origins manga? I nope. watched the Gundam Origin TV or animated series, but I didn't read the manga, no. That's how they get you um, the first hit of Gunpla is free. Now enjoy your addiction. They knew exactly what they were doing. 100%. And now this year we're helping out to sucker other people into the hobby. Yep. Now look what happened. Now we're going back to the exact same convention and we're going to be the people suckering people into the hobby. Yep. You must have been pretty good with your schedule. The lines for those workshops fill two to three hours before. We came back three times and we were like, please let us into your workshop. Like, we're not going away. Yeah, and I feel like at the very end, they're like, well, it's not for another whatever, but you can line up. And we're like, oh, thank you. Yeah, they just let us line up and... Probably by out. the third time, they were like, oh, these these guys again? Come these on. fucking girls. <laughs> God. The plastic addiction. We were addiction. trying all day. Yeah, we were. The plastic addiction always um, expands. Didn't take well, them long. To go outside a gunpla. Yup. The seed MGs had like oh, lights in them. I want the seed MGs so badly. Zombie! Hi, zombie! Hi, zombie! Cat treat both. We don't have any cats in here, which we, is crazy. We've been abandoned by all of our cats today. We're gonna have to go find some. I saw a little man on the cat tree when I was throwing out the cup so I can get him. I legit saw a kitty kit at Hobby Lobby and thought it looked good so I bought it. I didn't realize I would need more than clippers. You, you don't, don't have to you sand. Don't need, you don't need to sand. We, it's only what you want to do. We didn't really sand at all when we first started. Like we had yeah. a nail file and we never used it. If you look at the um, a, the first astray we did in the first dual assault, you can see all of the nub marks because oh, I didn't yeah. bother sanding. Like no, they're, they're, they're all visible. very visible. Like looking on the back here. Sanding is only really if you want like a really there. smooth surface or you care about the finish of the kit when it's all put together and you don't want to see the nub marks. But the great thing about Gundam is whatever you do or don't decide to do is entirely up to you and any way of building or putting together Gunpla is valid. And it's completely fine. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, you really only need clippers. And even then, a lot of the pieces you could One pop of my close out. friends just uses n n nail clippers. Yep. And just cuts them with nail clippers. You don't have to do anything. You do whatever you want. Little skins. <laughs> Chill out, dude. Bonk. Got bonkered. Got bonked. The guy likes to sleep on damp towels. That's interesting. I've never heard that. I Make feel like people first. who get warm in their sleep would like that. Yeah. I might get my first Gunpla kit at Anime North. Uh, See well, you at if, Anime! If you're gonna get your first one at Anime North, you could just do the free workshops. Go back and then get a free one. Yeah. Absolutely. When we went to Otakuthon, they were doing three free entry grade kits. You could get an entry grade granddad, you could get a an anime figurized Goku, or you could get a Pokeplo, which was a Pikachu. So if you do one of those, then there's typically free kits that you can build. They'll give you like a tiny little tool pouch and then you can do it that way. Or you could just bite the bullet and if you decide you can try to, yeah. you can look around and pick one. Absolutely. Pick a kit to buy instead. You might as well sign up for a free one. Just in case you wanted to try it first. Just to see. Um, and then yeah. And there'll be a lot of kits on display, so you can always look at those and be like, Oh, I really like the way that one looks, and then go find and buy that one. 
I think at Anime North they're gonna have a full Witch for Mercury display, which means every Witch for Mercury kit that's been released by Bandai, they will have built on display. Yes, and which I think they're. Impressive. I think they're because of the new Seed movie. They're highlighting that this year too. Yeah, I think they're gonna try to highlight Seed. I think I remember seeing that in the presentation. Okay. I think the, um, the competition might have a seed category because of the movie. That's probably what you're thinking Maybe of. that's what I'm thinking. A special, because they did Witch for Mercury last year. Yeah, because Witch for Mercury was, like, the show last yeah. year. Hi, ladies. Hope you're doing well. We're doing good, zombie. Hello. Thank you. It's good to see you again. The original Gundam anime, um... Was made to help increase the Gundam toy sales. Well, they did a really good job. <laughs> they did. I think that's any time they make an anime is to <laughs> increase yeah. sales of the Gunpla. Yes, sanding plastic is bad. Bad to breathe in. Yeah, so I wet sand. But not everybody does, and I, I'm, yeah. I'll I'm, i never tell someone that you have or don't have to do it. Yeah. Again, the way you build is totally up to you. This is just the way that I like to build. There you go. I tried sanding, and now I just use a hobby knife. There you go. Yeah, use everyone does it their own way. Whatever is easy for you. There's not really any right or wrong. Yeah. And if people tell you there are, they're kind of just trolling. Yeah. Maybe do the build thing there, meeting up with people and stuff there. Not sure entirely what the plan is. Yeah. Hey, go with the flow. That's what I do. That's what Peanut does. That's what she exists for. That's how I get through life. I go with the flow. I go where the wind takes me. Gunplay is fun. Yes, it is. Hasbro makes good model kits, though. Whoa, Hasbro, Hasbro makes make? model kits. I'd be interested. You Hasbro? Mm -hmm. I Hasbro. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go find a cat or two. Go find a little kitty. Now that I'm working on the second leg, I kind of remember more or less how the first one went together, so it's helping me speed up my pace a little bit on the on this side. Oh. It must be warm in this room, because after Peanut opened and closed the door, I felt like a wave of cold air. I found one. She came running. She came running to you? So oh, it's like, she saw you and she's like, you're the snack lady. She's like, oh, you schmuckos. Probably she's got to come up. Come on up. Come on up, sweetie. No, you got to come up. Come on. You got to. Come on up. Oh, oh. yeah, yeah. <gasps> good girl! Oh, good job! Lady, you are getting so many snackies. You're getting an upset tummy, okay? I'll give you another one. You can have one more and that's it, Lady. One more. You're purring? I'll break this one up so you think you're getting more than one. Whoa. Look at that. This little girl's purr. She sees you and she's like, oh, you have the good good. She's so, like Cotton, she's very food motivated, eh? Brave jumping up. Okay, just broke that into four. So you thought you got five. Whoa. The immediate purring, because she's like, oh my god, snacks. <laughs> you may want to close the tree bag before she starts to riot. Good job. Yeah. Oh jeez. The hiccups. Okay, no, I have to close this. No lady, no. No lady girl. Lady, please. No lady. <laughs> No. Are those Friskies Temptations? No, they are not. I Good just job. saw your Canadian. Oh, <laughs> Skins, we've been Canadian. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? Skins. Oh, Skins. Is this your first day, brother? What's going no, on? Skins has been here forever. I know. Skins is a homie. She's pretty. She is pretty. She's, she's a, a sweetie. She's a beautiful senior citizen. She's being very brave today. And she's purring nonstop. I will go get another meow meow, but I'm gonna give her her time before I bring one of the boys up. What are you purring? Give her a second to bask in her yummy treatsies. You purring like crazy? Whoa. Cause when the boys come in, she'll run away. Yeah. And I, I want her to think this is, she is safe here. So I don't want to just, she saw me as the treat person. So I don't want to go and bring a cat and freak her out. Lady, good job. Cat crack. Mm -hmm. Gosh, she's had so many treats today. Yeah, we have to slow down, honey. <laughs> she's 
She's gonna love when you come over. Yeah. You're gonna be her new favorite. Wow. You and Mia would get along so well. You'd be old ladies together and just snuggle. Girl cat personalities are so different from boy cats. She's a sweetheart. Yeah. Are you feeding them catnip? Not today, but they do have catnip. I get, um, I have a, a catnip, I have, I have a catnip person. Is it grandma? And that is our grandma. <laughs> I have a, my dealer, my catnip dealer. It is our grandmother, she grows it, and she'll, she'll dry it for me, and she gives me these plastic bags full of it. And it definitely looks like something else. Oh, you touched the bag. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> no, it's empty. Do you want to see it's empty? Empty bag. Empty bag. See? Okay. How dare you. Empty bag. You're a beautiful girl. Look at you. Oh, the big purring. The biggest purring. No, I know, but it just showed up when she just pop in A out of nowhere. Yeah. Girl said, no. No, I'm so sorry. Don't get an upset tum tum. I was just, oh, there it is. Don't get an upset tum tum. Oh my god, she's gonna jump. There we go. Bye, she lady. Goes. She's still purring. Granny is a drug dealer. For catnip, she is. For cat drugs. Good job. Okay, I'm gonna go get one of uh, the other ones. You one of the other boys? Yeah. One of the other boyos? Okay. No problem. And this connects to this. This way? Like this? I can hear her talking to the cats in the hallway. <laughs> I think there was one stream where we got to see Loki passed out in the middle of the floor after some catnip. He goes very s psycho and then it doesn't last very long and then he's down for the count. It's kind of funny. He goes absolutely ham and he will fight you for a bag of catnip. Like if you have catnip, he will do everything in his power to get that catnip from you. He has no chill whatsoever. It's kind of funny. I don't remember which one this goes into, is it? This one, this way? We're gonna hope so, because these close. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this. I got a little man. She followed me down the stairs and kept purring. She non stop purring. Hey, little boy. Ooh, big stretch. I need, uh, I need your thumb strength in a second. My big ol' thumbs? Yeah. She's back! Cool. Lady. She is my shadow. She like Lady, snacks. Look at the snackies. Okay. You know you have to say thank wow. you. She doesn't have to say thank you because she's a little lady. This is from John. You guys say thank you. Thank you, manners. Little bits, little bits at a time. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Yummy, yummy. Oh, Mister. Your box is being commandeered. Oh, he can have it if he wants it. It's kind of some nubs in it. Oh. They've just kind of been flinging in. She's standing over by the door. Come on, Annie girl. Here you go, little man. If you want your box, you can have it. Oh, I just want to make sure he doesn't step. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> she did not like that. Is that a main coon? No, it is not. Any sound kind of sets her off. <laughs> That's fair, she's skittish. Hi, Tizilla. Whew, hello, hello. No, um, that is just a long-haired <sighs> garbage cat. Long-haired garbage cat, yeah. Long, uh, gremlin, side of the road, highway cat. Just a domestic long hair. He's yeah. a big boy. He looks like it. He is the smallest, scrawniest squirrel cat. Can you... He just has so much fluff. 
Can you try to push? See how that's not fully closed? I don't know where it's stuck. I'm guessing it's somewhere here because that's not fully on. I guess I could pop it out and pack, pop it back together. Pop off. Let's see if I can pop it off. Out of the stuff in your throne, what is the model you would like to build the most? I think I get the most excited about building things that we haven't built before. Because I like comparing different brands and different styles. I like anything goofy. Anything goofy looking? Anything goofy looking or different? That's where my attention is like, ooh! Oh, okay. Oh, I can do it. I think I got it. Dumpster cat, pretty much. I hope you're Whoa. having both having a great day today. We're doing pretty good. It is a beautiful day out. I think the weather was supposed to get to a high of zero. Oh. It is a high of minus... Oh, it's actually plus one right now. That's great. We have to go into the throne and either change the address to your address or remove the Solaris items because they ship over the ocean on a boat and take months to get here. And if I am being evicted from this property, I will not be here by the time it arrives. Do you understand the predicament? I see the predicament we I see what in. might be wrong here. <laughs> okay, so do we want to do that right now? Yeah. I would just change it to yours and then we can swap it after the fact. Okay. But that way we don't have to change things on the wish list itself. How do I Go to the settings. It? Nope. Top Set right. Top right. Click on the picture. I didn't set it. Hmm. Uh, where's the address? You figured it out. I did figure it out. Show details. Yes. Okay. There you go. Hope you're both having a great day today, Tazilla. Thank you. I hope you guys are having a great day. Saturday and Sunday, I look forward to as days to like relax, unwind, do all the stuff that you've been waiting to do throughout the week. And just fine. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Thank you for the follow. Can thank I you, thank it you. To your phone number still, or yeah. should I change it to mine? It's okay. Save details. Success. Success. All done. Now, when things get lost in the middle of the ocean, they will arrive. <laughs> Something will happen. Something shall happen. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. oh you got that one. I love you too. Thank you. Yeah, we're just kind of hanging out, having fun, hanging out with you guys. That's good. I'm in a debate of a couple things. Model kit, new headset, or SD card for a device. Ooh. Um, Alibaba? I think I've started to realize, I think it was Cody that showed me you can buy things off of eBay. So I've started looking at like hard to find kits off eBay. Like I'm obsessed with this one, Hatsune Miku, like model kit, yep. but she looks like a robot. Mm-hmm. I know what you're talking about. So that to me is really cool because you make anything look like a robot and like I'm sold. It's super cute. I mean a lot of the Miku figures or kits oh, are like really it. nice. The quality is so nice. Yeah. I but mean, I can't justify getting into the figure hobby when I have a gunkla problem. <laughs> like I can't do both. No, that's You fair. have to pick one. Yeah. I mean like I would have no space for a figure collection. It is Miku, so we you... already have 69 gunpla. <laughs> More than that, because we're kind of like, well, yeah. roughly. Um, and that's not even the not built ones. You guess he was this Tootsie in my build space. Look at that toe hair. That Grinch foot. Look at this toe hair, yeah. Um, I mean, with Miku, because she is like a celebrity, I would say, like, you come to expect that, like, good quality when it comes to that. Mm hmm. Because it is like merch. It's, that represents it's a very her. good brand image. Because I mean, there's some celebrities that have had merch, people celebrities, and it was bad. And people are very vocal about it because, like, that's, they expect a certain standard, right? Yes, and it's wouldn't you want it to be good? Because that's what represents you. Yeah. So it's there's a weird disconnect sometimes. Yeah, Miku stuff is always well done. Always. At least the official stuff. Fair. Because there's oodles of unofficial I'm, stuff. Yeah. Welcome back, Magus. Okay, I think I finished A Runner. Let me do a quick. All kit is either Verka, Zeta, or Barbatos, or Unicorn. 
or the HG Satria. Yigong! Satria's a big boy. Big boy bananas. So it's out of those kits, a new headset. Do you have other, do you have a backlog? I hate to be that person. Do you have a <laughs> backlog of kits already? Like what is, is there a really good deal going on right now? Is that why it's like pushing you to get a new kit? Cause I feel like anyone could benefit from a new headset or an SD card, you know? Spoken by someone who doesn't like to build model kits. Peanut likes to paint them. She doesn't like to build them. So she doesn't fair. get excited about a backlog. That is completely fair. Hey, you're so right for that. I don't like to build. So I would think... So she prefers the other two. A quality two. of life difference versus an instant dopamine hit. You know what I mean? I could be wrong. I'm curious, how long would the MGEX Strike Freedom take you to build? An HG takes me four to five hours. How long did that strike take you to build? That was an MG Strike. I think the MG Strike took me 12 hours. I think an HG is five, four to five. RG is about eight mg is about three streams three streams in a bit so 12 yeah 12 to 15 hours for an mg i've never built an mg ex before so i don't know if it's like the same amount of time yeah. that it takes to build an mg yeah because i don't have the frame of reference yeah and Fair. I've never built a PG either, so I don't know how long a PG is going to take. We do have one in the backlog. We do have one, two in the backlog from Amawaz and Glenn. Yeah. I think those are going to take me like 30 hours. Mm. I mean, I built also, very slowly. I was about to say, from when you started, and it was just pretty much cut and put together, you were getting through them a little bit faster. It was still three to four, so. But now it's between like four to five. Yeah because you put that extra time into- I really enjoy building, so I take my time when I'm building. Because yeah. I like all the nubs to be smooth, I like the, the double clips, I like watching it come together. It's all together. And that's without stickers or anything. Like, I typically will build everything and then sticker after the fact. The only sticker I typically do while I'm building is the eye stickers, because yep. they're hard to get back into once yes. you've got everything put together. Yeah, I never did a PG myself. We, um... We're not experts. <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't call us experts by any means. We're just fans. Yeah. We just enjoy. Enjoy what we do. We like to spend that time with y'all. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. We. Bam, bam. Bam. We have a, a bad habit of mimicking sounds when we hear them. Do you know what that's called? Autism. Autism. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. God damn it, not again. Oh, it's right here. Yeah, you should have seen me at the zoo. Oh my god, it was bad. Because no. there's so many noises at the zoo, and I mimic so many of them. When did you go to- what time of the year did you go? Summer. I want to go again. We can go. We but can go to the zoo. Gone, I've gone a long Let's time. Let's just go to the zoo. I also get a really good deal. Ah. Let's just fucking go to the I, zoo. Because I know somebody. <laughs> I know a person. We'll, t we'll send the gang a picture of you with the monkeys. <laughs> They're gonna want to see it. I'll stand Watch as far as I can away. <laughs> Watch your profanity. Yo. Watch your profanity. Hey, what up, beautiful sisters? What's going on? Time to go back building. Bye, Maggie. Let you go. Welcome on in. It's good to see you again. Keyford has never done a PG themselves either. Yeah, what PGs in your backlog? We have two in our backlogs. We've got an Astray and we've got an Exia. Which I can't believe we have a fucking Exia. That blows my mind. Exia is a big meme on this channel for anyone who's new. Big meme. Peanut painted an Exia a year ago, a year and a half ago. A year and a half. It was meant to be a Valentine's Day custom paint. I built the Exia because, again, for anyone else who's new, I'm the older sister Smiley. I do all of our building. Peanut's my younger sister. She does all of our painting. So we're kind of like a, a team effort. So I built the Exa for Valentine's Day. She was gonna do a custom Valentine's Day paint. It was gonna be modeled after the Sweetheart Candies. 
She didn't put any thought into what she wanted it to look like, and she just started blasting. I started blasting. So it didn't turn out the way that she liked it. She's banished the kit from ever appearing on stream. Yeah. <laughs> it's like oh, oh, just yeah, a oh, big yeah. joke in the oh, chat. Yeah, really? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Jonathan, thank you, come on, I mean. Um, yeah, it is a meme. It is now um, equivalent to Mothman or Bigfoot. It is a cryptid. Yeah. Um, <laughs> does, does it exist? Yeah, no. Does it not exist? People have very blurry images of it that they post in Discord. <laughs> Nobody's really sure if it's real or fake at this point. So Glenn, as a joke, got Peanut the PGXia, and then Amoez got me the Astray PG. Because the Astray is one of my favorite Gundams of all time. The M1 Astray is my favorite. Yeah. Technically not a Gundam, but it's my favorite mo mobile suit. Blast the airbrush? No, it was hand painted. We didn't even have an airbrush at the time. It no. was hand painted. Airbrush is very new. It's a very new thing. Um, pretty much all of, other than two kits, everything else is hand painted. Um, and it shows, for sure. And he stands up there loud and proud, but nobody can see him because I refuse to show anybody, which is why pack away all the Gundams that way. It will be the 69th kit that I show everybody. It will be the very last one that I show on camera. Because it's been banished for so long. <laughs> yep. Astray was from Seed, right? Technically, yes, because the Astray was the orb mobile suit piloted by... Kagali and Kagali's, I call them like her woman warriors. So that was the M1 um, mobile suit. It was kind of like the prototype. Mobile suit with a katana. Sold. <laughs> <laughs> what is your favorite zoo animal? Um, my favorite animal has always been tigers. Always. You know what? Yeah, that checks out. It's never changed. Winnie the Pooh, you love Tigger. T I double G R. Tigger. The last time I was at the zoo, I wanted to just sit and watch the otter for hours. And I was like, well, I guess I have to go see the rest of the zoo. But he was so cute. He was so adorable. Yeah. Oh, I loved it. It was good. It was cozy. I've done a little bit of research and the MGEX looks interesting. Okay, now today you look like twins. Like you can tell uh, your sisters. I don't know what it is, but you two look great. Thank you! I was calling myself a 13-year-old boy earlier today, so that she makes definitely me feel was. Good. <laughs> I'll put the hat back on and see if you can see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Their fuzzy photos like bug butt. Building Gundam and Haikyuu follow alert? This is a good place to hide. My 13-year-old boy yet. We do like our Gunpla. We're both really big anime fans. Haikyuu is one of my favorite sports shows of all time. I also play indoor volleyball and outdoor volleyball because of Haikyuu. What a nerd. Like, inspired me to go do volleyball. Mm. I think a movie just came out. A Haikyuu movie came out this year. I have to watch that still. Yeah. Hey, yo, Bronut? <laughs> yo, wake up! I built yeah. my PG Exia as I am watching your stream. What up, bird soup? What's going on? Tigers are the apex. Siberian tigers, beautiful. If I may, the hand vacuum clean is super. It's so handy, Megas. I Otters love smell it. like poop? Otters. I wasn't close enough to smell it. <laughs> I'll be real. I was pretty far away. In 16 redeemed pack of plamo. Pack of plamo. We're doing pretty good. We are doing pretty good. I like um, pretty good. I like the penguins too. Penguins Five, are fun. Six. I don't think they were out last time I went to the zoo. Mind you, it was also That's like great. summertime. Um, the polar bears were out, but they looked like they were super unhappy. Yeah, I, I don't feel great about polar bears being this far south. So. Um, what, other, what else do I like? I always like going through the snakes and the bats, <clears throat> the places where no one else likes to go. Yeah, because they're creepy crawlies. And I purposely like, stay out of that pavilion. I, I just love shot them. I don't mind looking at the spiders or the bugs. I like them too. Um, the birds, I love looking at. A lot of the birds are in with like the turtles and alligators and it just smells like dead fish in that exhibit. I love it. <laughs> it's my favorite. Otters have a musky smell. That's putting it nicely. Another SD, our matching boy. Arsene. Doink. Persona. <laughs> I love Benjamin and Arsene. Benjamin. 
I think they're great. Look at Deeb. I like that they're just so different looking from regular like Gumpla and Gundams. Yeah, they do. The amount of stickers aren't great. I feel like it would be interesting to like see how to paint one of these. Yeah, we've never painted an SD. We've always just used the stickers. Yeah, I mean, we've panel lined, but that's We it. also haven't built an SD in a long time. Damn, it's been a while. We have that MGSD Barbato, so that'll be probably the next one. Yeah, the last MSD I built was the Hello Kitty SD from Zero. Ah, yep. But I don't think it had many stickers. It had a couple, but it wasn't crazy. And with the panel lining, it looks really sharp. I'm really happy with it. Mm. I think I panel lined that one myself. I was feeling ballsy. Good for you. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Followed as I'm going um, away, though, looking forward to future Gundam in anime discussions. Thank you for coming by. Thank you, Thank Jarvin. You. It's very nice. Jarvin, Javin. Isn't he the computer from Jarvis. Jarvis from Iron Man? I like how I could read your brain we're as connected. you were saying. We're connected. Mine arrived and I'm pretty happy with the product. Mm. Spaces. I love reptiles forward. and birds, I do too. I always wanted um, a snake when I was, I mean, I still do. But um, when I was younger, especially, I, I had turtles, I had salamander, I had hermit crabs, fish. Smiley had the furry pets. Bunny. The cute Bunny pig. furry ones. And I had the scaly, slimy ones. But I love them. I always wanted a snake. But I don't think I'll, I'd ever get one. I mean, who knows? But I love rats. And I feel like keeping them in the same house would be cruel. Gotta bounce. Bye! Bye, Bye Keeper! Thank you for stopping by! See ya! Is that blue thing the Bandai Parts separation tool? It is. It's very handy. I've got tendonitis in both of my thumb joints, so I have no strength in my thumbs to separate parts. Uh, and sometimes they're a little bit too snug for Peanut, who is the the buff nut of the family. So it's nice to have a part separator to help out when the, the times get tough. I think it was only like six dollars or something, so it was pretty cheap. Not bad at all. Yeah, because things can be very expensive, so it was nice to see something at a, a considerably lower price point. Yeah. I've got the MGSD Freedom, and it's so amazing. Oh, is it? The MGSDs I'm very curious about, so I'm excited for the Barbatos, because I've never done one before. I'm excited to see, like, the proportions. I had two garter snakes, Speedy and Lightning Jack. His That's full badass. name, Lightning Jack? That's sick. Do you also 3D print your Ooh. own stuff and assemble them? We don't have a 3D printer, so we have not done any of our own 3D printing. The only thing we've done with our, like, handmade is with air dry Empty. clay. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're resourceful, if nothing else. <laughs> That's as far as we've gotten. Ugh, I gotta stretch my leggies. With making our own model pieces. <laughs> yeah. how sharp the toes are. They are very sharp. Look who's back. Back again. I'm gonna take my hat off because I don't want to spook her. Hi! Hi, to Christina. She comes straight to you. You are the keeper of treats now as far as I she's am. concerned. The keeper of the snackums. Hi, pretty girl. She just looks at you lovingly. She doesn't look at me like that. Lady, what's going on here? You picking favorites? Go. She's pretending not to. <laughs> she's looking between the two of us like she still has feelings for me, but I'm not so sure. She looks at the back of your head when you look away. Hi, lady. Whoa. Yeah. Little man's taking a nappy up here, but you'll be okay. Look at your little socks. Kitty, kitty, kitty. She does have little sockies. Come on up. How does the FM compare to the uh, MG so far? We haven't built the MG Aerial. Haven't built an MG Aerial. It doesn't have the same kind of inner frame that an MG does. It still builds very similar to the way an HG would, but there's just more parts to build it up. The full mechanics 
reminds me more of if you guys have ever done the Tamashii Nations figures, it very much feels like a Tamashii Nation figure, which I think is a very nice quality to be perfectly honest with you. It's also quite large. Can you keep your waist on please ma'am? Gotta come up honey girl. I feel like the waist pops pretty easily on this so I'm gonna try my best not to move it too much. But it looks like it's more of a figure than a Gunkla. I don't know if it's just how like glossy the... This is from... The kid is? It's Lechiko. Oh, she's praying again. I'll get the camera. It's Lechiko, say... say she you. purrs anytime she's given snackies. She say thank you. Breaking up in pieces. Breaking up in pieces. Oh, so many. Mandy, wow. She's being so brave. Can you guys hear that? Oh, she's slobbering on my hands. Oh yeah, she is a big drooler. Oh, I should have maybe warned you. She is drooling. She's a big drooler. Oh, is that yummy? Oh, God. Is this the yummiest thing that you've ever tasted? Oh god. That was so good. Big purrs. I think I figured out how to be your best friend. Just give her the snackies. Well, you eat them all. You eat them all. <laughs> I'm in love. Wow. I'm in love with her. I don't have any. This is plastic. You want to... Oh. She's no like, interest in Gumpla. I'm not interested. She's like, I know where you keep your snackies. I'm gonna go get your snackies. No, honey girl. No, I'm so sorry. Wow, look at you. You're such a brave girl. You're so brave. I don't know how great her vision is because sometimes she's like face to face with some of the other cats and she doesn't notice. <laughs> and then she hisses because she's like, how dare you? And I'm like, lady, you walked into them. I don't know if you saw this coming, but... <laughs> yeah. I'm going and for way like, down. She's offended. She's like, yeah. how dare you and come into my space? she's the one that did it. <laughs> You want to go over there? Are you sure about you that? You see, this is what I mean. She doesn't know he's here. Are you sure about that? And she's like, this is a great idea. I'm just going to walk along this desk. And she'll walk. If I don't do anything, she'll walk right into him. Do you have space to be? Because you're kind of in a really precarious spot. And it's making me nervous. Honey, girl. Honey. Are you sure about this? I know. Are you sure about that? You're blind, lady. Lady, girl. Okay, go this way. Go safe. I know you're literally not the oldest thing as old as dirt, but I'm treating you like it. It's so funny, because she puts herself in bad situations. She's like a little tiger, a little tigress. She's very sweet, she's very shy. So when she comes around, if we kind of stop what we're doing, it's because we want to make sure- To encourage her. We want to encourage her confidence um, and for her to explore. She's being a very good girl. Because she's new to the home, so we want to make sure that she's comfortable. Yeah. That I, she's settling in. I've 3D printed some things, and it helps a lot, but most things I 3D print are home utilities and cosplay. Oh. I can still hear her. I know she's in the room, because I can hear her going like a lawnmower. She's purring. She's got a very loud purr purr. Mm -hmm. goes here. That's a good girl. This one on the bottom. This one. Middle. Where? The other side. Oh. Get in there. Okay. Sick. Oh, whoops. I did it again. Oops, I did it again. I get excited and connect stuff before I'm supposed to. Deez mm. what it is. Fair enough. That one wasn't bad enough that I needed a part separator, which was good. Good. Does there like is there a sticker that goes in there? Mm. You have the sticker sheet. Oh. But I would assume so. Is there some 
thin pieces, but they're gray, so I don't know. I don't know. Maybe not. There we go. Attach these side bad boys. I think I've got like four pieces left total and then I'm complete. Damn. So I'll have extras in these runners and I'm curious to see what the extras are. Mm -hmm. I think I saw some hand pieces that were extra. These pieces are undergated, which is great. So nothing that I need to do for these. Mm -hmm. Oh, good girl. There she goes, still purring. Bye, lady. There she goes. Purr, purr. Going down her little step. Oh, what a smart girl. Okay, this one here. Oh, the blood our kits are built upon. AKA, uh, Cuts and stabs. Very true. Yeah. It'd be like that sometimes. Did you get yourself, Magus? Did you get yourself? I think I've been pretty fortunate where I don't think I've injured myself building, but I also am too timid to use a hobby knife. Mm. So I think that's a big part of it. Empy. Empy. And then I'll have to take a look to see if I missed any pieces, if there's anything that I was supposed to use but skipped over. So I'll flip back to the front of the book and see what Ooh. pieces I'm supposed to have left over. Back to yuck counting, 206. That's oh. the first one of the day. I think there was but one probably, right when we started streaming. But we probably missed a couple. I've been yucking. I can explain. Can you, Magus? Can you? Magus, did you injure yourself? Are you typing with a keyboard or voice to text? That will give us an indication. <laughs> um, no. I don't think you can voice to text that little st tongue face. Oh, that one almost hit little man. The undergating here is pretty good. I've let two or three slide. Fair enough, purple. Oh, no. Like, it's... I tune them out, honestly, at this point. Like, I, I don't, don't even, even notice. notice them. Yeah, sometimes you guys tell me... Sometimes if it's a very loud, powerful one and I yes. feel it, I'm like, oh, okay. And I'm like, whoa. I <laughs> but I wouldn't even, like, notice or remember if you guys didn't keep track. It's at that point. Like, it is just so normal. Look at these dummy thick thighs. <laughs> like she's got the thickest I was about out of to all say the gumpla. Does she have the thickest thighs? The thickest. For proportionally her proportion. to the rest of the body. Exactly. I like her we are, same brain. We are the same. Okay, let me get all these nubs yep. out of here. Absolutely. She is the thickest. Like look at her hips. Literally look at her Those hips uh, don't lie. You know her birthing saying? hips. I like how when I start vacuuming, he tucks everything back into the box. He's like, well, I don't know if it's safe to be here. Yeah. Okay, so I have a couple pieces, extra pieces here. I've got, these look like hand pieces here. Do you have a little baggie that I can, uh, do you have any extra uh, baggies? Nope, I used them all up. Okay. So I can go get more. Because I like to keep all of the extras just in case, you know? Yeah. Thick thighs save lives. Yes, waka, that waka, is true. Waka, waka. Waku waku! Run! Waku waku! Waku waku! Good to see you again, Ron! Of course! Inserts an explanation that seems possible. And I guess that is so true. Actually, that's a really good point. I didn't consider that. I'm surprised you guys are still streaming. I thought I missed it. We're on... We're just about at 4 hours and 30 minutes. So we probably won't be on much longer. We typically go for four, so we're a yes. little bit over today. But I wanted do, to get this um, kit done. We do have a couple things we need to do today. Before we lose the sun? Yes. While the weather is a little bit nicer. So I think now is actually pretty good timing. Yes, perfect. Burrs and hips. Yeah, she's got them. Ampy. Yampy. Crush mobile suit heads with those bad boys. But you could. But she has. 
What is this piece? I feel like this piece probably belongs somewhere, because that... The other pieces I can make excuses for, that one looks like it probably goes somewhere. Oh yeah, that looks like a, a critical that piece. That definitely looks like it's supposed to be doing something. Is it like a, a... Does it go here? That goes there. It goes there. That's hollow. You are correct. I'm so smart. What's that, the chest? Yeah. Okay. Or like, torso. It was great watching y'all stream again. I'll catch you next time. Bye. Time for the gym. Enjoy oh. Dante. It was good to see you. Go for 12 hours today. Surprise! It's actually a 24 hour stream. Okay, there we go. Torso. Keep, I'm gonna go count sheeps. Stay awesome. Blossom ladies. Keep spreading those good vibes. Hasta la bye bye. Bye! bye. It was good to see you again each. Oh, oh, throwing things. Sorry. We're throwing things. Okay. Uh, it's 2 a.m. here? Yes, go to sleep. Saw, this, saw some logs. This I've got to get the second cuts off of. These look like insert pieces, so these two don't need to be sanded, but these other two might. Um, no, actually, I can clean that up okay with the cutters. Okay, actually. Sorry, little man. I, I got a piece got of his fur. He didn't want enjoy that. Yeah, he felt it. Okay, if this you dare disturb me goes into the sides. Shh. Oh, I'm probably gonna have to take this out to put these in. Just kidding. I'm kind of. A fucking badass. I just gotta say how lovely you two look in spite of the current moving situation. Thanks, Oni Maru. Um, I mean, I'm I'm here as a support. I'm a, I'm here as a supporting cast. Um, it's Smiley that's really going through it. Popped its head um, But I keep bringing you boxes over. Um, Thank you. I will be here for whenever moving day is. Now my vehicle is much bigger than it was before, so I can fit a lot of stuff in there. Hmm. It's not gonna go in the way that I would like it to go in. Okay, I gotta take the backpack off, I think. Boop. This bad boy needs to come off. Oh, SpaghettiOs. Do you not want to come off? You do not want to come off. What about you? Yeah, you do. This looks correct. But then this doesn't want to, like, take it. I'm glad that all of the red metallic -y bits are, um, like, actual pieces rather than stickers. Because we've had it where they tried to make, like, textury looking metallics. And you can tell. But this looks really nice. Waka 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 waka! Well, these arms will never pop off. They're so thick. <laughs> it's, I think the waist is the, the trouble part on this kit. Let's go. This way. Yeah, the waist is the most likely joint to pop off on this kit. Hmm. Vaz! Oh, I didn't hear it. Hi, Vaz! Waku waku! Thank you, Vaz. Fist pumps enthusiastically. <sighs> 14 months. Holy, holy, holy moly. Okay, so Thanks, Vaz. It's pieces. good to see you. This goes in here. Look at her. She's yeah, beautiful. Let me get the last couple of nubs off of here. Ask a question. Colonel Peanut, is there going to be any gun tank 
for like gunpo wedding favors for guests idea would be gun take wedding veil gun take wedding veil how on earth i found another nub sorry little man he looks spooked every time <sighs> um as far as i am aware i do not have any gundam wedding favors but that may be subject to change Maybe if my uh, significant other, my fiance, was into Gundam or Gunpla, we might, but they don't share the hobby. So maybe I could slide something in there, but we'll see. Done. You never know. She big. She's beautiful. I love. Her waist is so skinny. It's very snatched. Very skinny, skinny mini. There is a sticker sheet that goes with it. So that's something that we can explore at a later oh, date. I thought thing. you were grabbing me the sticker yeah, sheet and you kinda. definitely skirted it. So oh, there's a lot of stickers up. that are possible. Look at this. I feel like she'll look so nice with the sticker sheet. Yeah. These are just clear stickers. They're not water slides or dry transfers. They're just clear, transparent stickers. Which I think for a full mechanics aerial, that's probably for the best. Mm. It looks really nice. It's big. Yeah. Like, she's tall. She is. A I love her. She's great. She looks really good. I'm impressed. Yeah. You wanna flip us? Sure do. Well, well, well. Well, would you look at that? Obviously, she will come down the aisle in a life size gun tank. Yeah, I'll just put my cardboard costume on from the first Halloween. That looks nice. It's big. Like, a good cake topper, that's true. Bigger than my hand for scale. Wow. She tall. She thick. She do be tall. She's yeah. great. I love the metallic. It makes a huge difference. Rather than it being like stickers, like actual proper yeah. pieces, I think that's really nice. To look at this in person, it looks more like a figure to me than it does a Gumpla. But again, that's just because I'm so familiar with the Tamashii Nation's figures. It's just so nice. It looks very similar. I don't know if it's like the finish on the plastic, but it looks different to me. It's very clean. Like the detail that it has compared to other kits is just diff different. It just Built is. different. Like this, I don't really see any seams. Normally a common place is on the sides. Are the legs, yeah, there's actually like no- Like I see one in the back where you would connect the two pieces. But they have the, what they've been doing lately on witch kits is they, instead of having a regular seam, It'll have a little indent, so it makes it look a little bit more intentional, which it, I think looks yes. nicer. They integrate that into the design, which is Yeah, huge. I think that's it. Is they're just accounting like for it in the designs. There is pieces here, but the shape of it, like, yeah. that just, it looks like the design. You would never know. It's very nice. It's so nice. I didn't build it. I can only speak on what I see, and it looks so nice. We're gonna have to figure out what we want to work on next next stream on Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Um, I guess what is left? Looks awesome, Smiley. Thank you. Thank you. Um. Well, it depends if you're building or I'm building. Because if you're building, you still have the. Impulse Gundam Lancer from Zombie. If I'm building, I think it's either a Plamod kit or a, a kit from Goose, I think would be next. Do you think I could build the kit from Zombie in one stream? Yes. Uh, then I'll do that. Okay, so we'll build the Impulse. Impulse Gundam Lancer, is that what it's called? Uh, yeah, it is. The guy. So we'll do a zombie kit next. And then that means after that, I'll probably be building a goose kit. Oh, sounds good. I have to look at my... My checklist. Can I have that? 
pen. My notebook? That Which one? cat pen. Meow. Oh, there's a little penguino. Okay, so the shore is it. I built. I didn't do it on stream though, so I still owe content on that shore is it. Full mechanics aerial. Built. Impulse. Barbatos. Zaku. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. I think those are the options. We're doing very Scratch good. Scratch that on Boink. All multiple legs done. Thank you, Glenn. You're not here. Thank you. Miss you. Keep a backlog tracker. Yes. All right, gang. Don't. We are going to go outside in negative five degrees weather to take some photos of the Huff collab Content. to send these back to Huff as a thank you for sending over the, the necklace and the, the hat. Living my 14-year-old boy fantasy. So catch us looking like goofs on social media. <laughs> Nothing showed up on screen! What, what the? What the hell was that? Did you guys hear a moe moe kyun? I heard a moe moe kyun. Moe moe kyun? Moe moe kyun? What the hell was that? Did that pierce your ears? Are you guys still with us? Can you hear? Bought oh, something on the throne, so the Moi Moi Kid was thrown! Sex! Thank you! Still, thank, thank you! Thank you! Oh no, I guess that's it. So if it made the sound, I don't you know why it didn't it. show up on screen, so that means Meg that has it's. Heard it. Where did it go? I don't know. Where did it go? This hat's also quick. Okay, work. so I went to throne. So it's a secret gift, so we don't know what it is. We don't know what it's gonna be until it gets here. Oh my god. So I will have to check to see if it gives me a tracking number or something, because depending on which gift it is, some of the gifts are um, local shops or like get here within two weeks. If it's a gift from Solaris, then that's a Japan retailer and it takes a long time for it to arrive. Oh, if so you don't even see it You yet. don't even see it yet? No, you clicked surprise secret gift, so we have yes. no idea what it is until it arrives. And so then, unless you want to tell us, that's fair, but it is a surprise, we don't know what it is yet. So what we like to do whenever we get something on Throne is we will bring the box with us on stream and we won't open it until you're here with us, because yes, we, we want to make sure that you're here to see when we, we receive the gift. We do a surprise, and so we, you get to see our reaction, because that's only fair. Um, and then it's ever it's a surprise to everyone else too. So we all find out what it is all at once. The only giveaway is sometimes the size of the box gives me a general indication of what is inside the box. But that's it. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So that's if it comes exciting. in an Amazon bag, I'm like, I wonder if this stands. Or like mm. paint supplies. <laughs> yeah. Let's do that. I wanna see that right Yes, okay, all that's right. what we typically do. So It'll if you're okay with that, then it's a surprise. Um, I'll see it might take a day before I get a tracking number to know roughly when it's going to show up. Yeah. Thank okay. you. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. That's very sweet. Uh, surprises you. are fun. Yes. Okay. We will save it whenever it arrives. Kick you guys. That's awesome. Thank so you. So we'll be back on Wednesday normal time, Wednesday 5 p.m. EST. Yeah. And Peanut, even though she's not a big fan of building, she's going to do her best to build an HG in a four hour time slot. Oh my God. We're going to see what happens. I love this kit because I call I keep calling this kit Aquaman. Yes, yes, this is true. Because this kit has um, what I like to call a trident. Yeah. You can't tell me this isn't a trident. This this is such an Aquaman kit to me, and I love it. <laughs> yeah. So we'll see you guys back on when. Do you want to swap me spots? Sure. Change uh. places. Oh, my back is hurting. Ch oh, you uh, old, old lady. Yeah. You old ma'am. Yes. Okay. We are going to send you guys over to Joe. Joe is live. Joe mama. So we'll send you guys over to Joe. Joe is a fellow Canadian Torontonian. Very sweet person. Yes. Out of box build part three. I wonder if that means it's a competition kit. Oh. Yeah. See what our competition is. Keep the competition. All right, Keep we're going to send you guys over there. Have a great rest of your weekend. Enjoy the rest of your night. And we'll see you back on Wednesday. Thank you for the stream. Have an awesome day. Touch lots of imaginary grass um, in five degree weather. We're looking at plus one. Plus one weather. We're going to get Smiley to go touch some grass.